Hello and welcome to more gaming fans. I'm your host Joe Moore here, and we're gonna go ahead and get started with our Heart Gold Soul Silver playthrough. As you know, we have been doing it through the regions. We did Fire Red first, then we did Emerald since we're gonna keep the trend going with uh, the GBA. And now we're officially on the DS games. So first game of the DS, and that's Generation 2. Of course, it's a Gen 4 remake. Uh, Heart Gold, Soul Silver of the original Silver and Gold. And um, I already did the uh, Professor talk and all that. So. Because I just explained it. Uh, GBA games first, then move to DS. Um. But anyway, we just talked to Lyra, and we're about to go get our first Pokemon, which you guys voted on. And it is Totodile that has been selected. Obviously, people know that we are using Charmander in every game of the playthrough. So, very wise choice out of the two that are possible, Chikorita or Totodile. So, we're going to go ahead, let Professor Elm talk about... His little issue or errand he needs us to do. And then we're going to go ahead and move on by uh, picking up our total dial. Well, welcome, welcome all to the chat. Who did you vote for? Let me know. Alright, so now it's our choice of what Pokemon to get. None are shiny. I mean, if one was shiny, we would obviously win with that one. But we're going to go ahead and get Total Dial, just like y'all voted on. And lucky for us, Total Dial is an amazing Pokemon. And I'm going to go ahead and nickname it, my favorite nickname for it. It's a water type. And it turns into a big ass crocodile that likes to bite things. So, Captain Crunch, I feel, is the most fitting name for this Pokemon. Let me know what nicknames you name your for Alligator. But for this playthrough, uh, this for Alligator will be Captain Crunch. How do you like walking with your Pokemon? It's not bad, is it? You can take it all the way to Mr. Pokemon's house. If your Pokemon gets hurt, you can heal here. Which should be an option in every Pokemon game. Surprisingly enough, though, this is the only game that does it. Joe, I want you to have these to help you with the task. And we get two potions. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I need to fix my stream thing. It says I'm playing the wrong game. So, for y'all to see the updated name, just go ahead and refresh after I save this. Through the regions. And I spelled that wrong. How do you spell through wrong? Uh, Johto? Pokemon. Heart Gold. Make sure double check that. Make sure that's the way it's supposed to be. I'm sorry, guys. Should have had this set up already. There we go. Now it should be updated for you guys. And we can go ahead and continue on with our playthrough. So now we got potions and the ability to heal our Pokemon. And Lyra again is here. Joe, so you picked a Totodile. Excuse me. That's a cute Pokemon you have. When you walk with it, it will become more friendly. You should turn around and talk to it sometimes too. Oh, that's right. Why don't you show it to your mom? See ya. So basically the easy way of telling us you had to talk to your mom before you head out on your adventure. So we'll do that. So look mom, my Totodile. His name's Captain Quint.
So now we are good to go on that aspect. Um, okay, so she's gonna, even though we tell her we know how to use the Poke Gear, she's gonna explain it to us anyway. Cause that's Pokemon for you. And now, we can go ahead and make our way this way. And of course we get stopped again. Wait one second! And he's just stopping us to add us to the Poke Gear. And also, how do y'all enjoy the background? Kind of went big with the title. <laughs> Pokemon Heart Gold, Soul Silver. Uh, finally decided to add my avatar that was made for me, along with my personalized Charizard. And um, I think it looks awesome. It looks dope. And uh, at the bottom of the screen, it's not blank. It's going to have the, the badges as we progress through the game and earn them. So, don't worry guys, there's going to be stuff filling all the gaps. I was going to use a webcam too, but I, in the process of making this, I did not think about the webcam at all. <laughs> so, um, I haven't added that yet. Maybe I'll go back to it. And the thing about Gen 2 is it takes a while for us to get our Pokeballs. So it'll take us a minute to officially start our thing. Oh man, I forgot to hit the record button. So I guess I'm going to have to just uh, download the whole video later. But welcome all to the stream. And if you're watching post on YouTube, please leave a like, subscribe, and don't forget to... Uh, Come by and check out the, the stream. The more followers, the better. We're going to have a giveaway pretty soon. We are sitting at 56 followers, but if we can get to 100 followers, um, I'll be giving away some plush toys. So, Pokemon plushies. So, Captain Crunch going to get some EXP here because we're going to need it. And there's no speed up for this game. So... We're kind of stuck here watching all the battles and such. So let's go ahead and get that chat going. And uh, find some stuff to talk about here. But of course, um, this game, uh, I could talk about it all day, really. I love this game. I've Nuzlocked Heart Gold a few times. Um, this is a Nuzlocke, by the way. Uh, we do get our special Charmander, as we always do. Uh, with our Through the Regions playthrough, anyway. And, um, I don't know. I just love this game. I played it so much as a kid, uh, endlessly. Probably more than Gen 1, because, I mean, you get to play Gen 1 eventually, anyway. The only thing I didn't care for was that levels kind of plateau at around 45 or so. So it's like... They could have made it a little more challenging post game, but they didn't. And uh, we won't be doing any post game stuff really. So, and we get to level six and learn Water Gun. So let's go ahead and check out if Water Gun's going to be helping us more than hurting us. Summary time. Okay, we have a bashful nature. I think that's a neutral nature. Welcome all to the stream. I'm going to look up this nature, though. Pokemon nature. Oh, okay. So, bashful is... Okay, never mind. It is a neutral nature. So that's not too bad. I mean, it's not great because we don't get our attack boost now. Or we, our attack isn't getting boosted. But, you know, it is what it is. And at least we have Totodile. It's a little quick tempered. I think that helps boost attack a little bit. But nonetheless, we got a beautiful little Crocodile boy just hanging out with us. And we can talk to it anytime we feel like. Oh, 
he didn't, he's dizzy. It's because he's only has six HP, and of course we're gonna have to talk to the old man here. So basically, he's he's the tutorial guide. He does all the basic stuff, like show us the Pokemon Center, Pokemart. But the benefit of talking to him is he actually gives us the running shoes. So that's definitely what we're gonna need here. And um, yeah, in the original games, you can't run either. I don't think it was told like Gen 3 is when you got the running shoes. So imagine going back to a time when you couldn't run in a Pokemon game. I'm telling you, it's horrible. But at least we get them here. And uh, I had a big problem <laughs> in this game with the running shoes thing. Because uh, normally, you don't have to, uh, normally you have to hold down the button. But in this game, you don't. Like, if you just select the little running shoe button on the side there, it'll automatically hold them down all the time. So now he's going to give us the map card as well. Because in the original games, you did get the map card only. You didn't get no running shoes again. So you couldn't go fast until... The third gym but now you can run around and have a good time and we're gonna go ahead and heal up our for alligator I mean total dial before before we take on anyone else and the weird thing about this game is you don't get pokeballs till after you go see professor elm again so technically the nuzlocke portion hasn't exactly started but we are doing a nuzlocke so for those of you who have watched us, you know, you know what a Nuzlocke is. And for those who don't, I will explain it real quick. So basically, we are going by normal rules of the Pokemon Nuzlocke. Rule number one, you can only catch the first Pokemon on each route. If you miss an encounter on the, that route, you're no longer allowed to, to get any other Pokemon on that route. So... You only get one shot, so catch it. Um, second thing is you have to nickname your Pokemon. If you catch it, you have to nickname it to build a bond with your Pokemon. So, you know, you're more worried about it fainting than not, I guess. So, Captain Crunch here is close to my heart, and I am not going to let him faint. And third and most important rule of a Nuzlocke, if your Pokemon faints, it is no longer usable, it's considered dead, put in the PC and walk away. Maybe cry a little bit, but you still have to walk away. <clears throat> and here we got Pidgeys again. But since it is our Through the Regions playthrough, there is a special rule for this Nuzlocke. We will always be granted the use of Charmander from the beginning of the game. Of course, we still got to catch it in these games. But uh, the code does work much better than it did in the Gen 3 game. So we will be catching a Charmander fairly easy. And we'll be using it through the playthrough. And it's not it doesn't count towards that encounter. It's just a poke. It's just a Charmander. You get it for us anyway i chose personally to choose charmander because i wanted to do like an ash catch em type deal with the pokemon games i wanted to um go ahead and use charmander in every game from beginning to end just like you know he does a pikachu he always takes pikachu to the new region i wanted to take a charmander to a new region i didn't want necessarily a charizard from the beginning either because that's kind of busted so I, I made it to where, you know, I just evolve a Charmander every time. And welcome, welcome everybody. How are you guys doing today? Hopefully y'all are enjoying your Monday. It's already over. All you got to do is chill back and relax now. <laughs> and watch me destroy Caterpies for the next few minutes. Um, my favorite starter of Gen 2 is probably, well, it's not probably, it's for sure, Cyndaquil. I love Cyndaquil so much. Uh, I used to, 
I loved it more in the original Gold and Silver than in the remakes. Because they made the worst change ever <laughs> in the second, in the remakes of these games. So in the original, once you get to the third gym, well, the third city, Golden Rod City, they have like the supermarket there and you can buy TMs. And back in the good old days, they had Thunder Punch, Ice Punch, Fire Punch. And, uh, what else? I think it was just, like, Hyper Beam or something. But now, it's, like, Secret Power and, you know, moves that are not as good as Ice Punch, Thunder Punch, and Fire Punch. And back then, there was no physical special split, so you give, um, Typhlosion, Thunder Punch, Fire Punch, and you're, you're fucking golden. You're set. And that's what made him one of my favorite Pokemon in this game. Sadly, you can't do that no more, but I still like to use Typhlosion quite a bit. 100 base stat in, in speed and that amazing special attack stat. It's still nothing to laugh at, so I'm okay with that. Typhlosion is still an amazing Pokemon. And Professor Oak is going to give us a Pokedex because... We are a 10 year old with a Pokemon with no adult supervision. Alright, so he's off to Goldenrod. We registered his number into our Poke Gear. We got his Pokedex. We got the mystery egg. We took a nap with two old men in the house, and we're good to go. Oh shit. So basically, um, that was, that was a mistake. Basically, Professor Ohm just called us, telling us about, um, a break-in at the lab, and someone stole a Pokemon. Funny enough, the one that's strong against us. So, let's hope that's not gonna be an issue. Certainly will be an issue after we get a Charmander. <laughs> Charmander's gonna wreck house. And if you're seeing those little black flakes go across your screen, it's not your it's not your computer, it's the game. I don't know why it does that, but it is what it is. Maybe it's just the aesthetic of being outside and it like shows the wind blowing or something. I don't know. Oh also guys, I added some features. Um for bits, you can start doing uh, Say It Live, so you can pay bits for um, a robot to say things on stream, and it should pick up. Um, we have Featured Viewer, so for so many bits, you can, uh, what's it called? You can promote yourself, basically, on my channel. And then we have Sound Alert activated, so if you decide to play pay some bits you can also play some sounds so all that fun stuff added to the stream but now we are getting growled by the chikorita so now that our Attack is lowered. Let's use our special attacking move. And oh, critical hit. And all he knows how to do is growl, apparently. So we're just going to take him out with the water gun here. And down Chikorita goes. Easy first win. Easy peasy. All right. Now Captain Crunch learns Rage at level 8. Ooh. He's jumping up with that EXP too. You want to know who I am? I'm the I'm going to be the world's greatest trainer. Oh shit, my wallet. Give it back. That's my trainer card. Oh no, you saw my name. 
did we like pickpocket him or something? Or did he actually hand us a card and was like, I'm gonna be the best ever. Oh shit, I wasn't supposed to give you that. Either way, sounds kind of dumb. Damn. Trying to avoid that. Alright, Pidgey. Uh, today's your lucky day. I'm just trying to get to the Pokemon Professor House. Now, let's go ahead and jump on in. Who are you? We are investigating the case of a missing Pokemon here. Rule number one, whoever did it will always come back to the site. Oh my, so you must be the one who did it. Perfect deduction skills there, Prof uh, Professor Dumbass. Hold on a second. He has nothing to do with it. I saw it. There was a red-haired boy looking into the building. Oh, she's already a better detective than I am. What, you battled a boy like that? He must be the one who did it. Did you happen to get his name? Yeah, his name is... Um... I'm gonna put Will. Chicken Will. It was Chicken Will. He stole the Chikorita. I see. Will was his name. Yep, you damn right. Will did it. My next assignment is to search for the red haired individual. And you never find him. Great police work. Yo, I'm glad they understand you're innocent. See you later. Professor Elm, you're just gonna let them arrest me? What the fuck is your problem? Oh yes, yeah, so it was Pokemon. Mr. Pokemon Big Discovery. Joe handed the mystery egg to Professor Elm. Huh? This is an egg, isn't it? This egg may be something I've never seen. Still, it is just an egg. Mr. Pokemon is always fascinated by eggs. Well, since he gave it to us, we might as well find out what secrets it holds. I'll keep it for a while and find out about the egg. Professor Elm, what? Professor Oak gave you a Pokedex? Fucker taking my job. Is that true? That's incredible. He is superb in seeing the potentials of Pokemon, uh, people as Pokemon trainers. Wow, Joe, I knew you were a little different. Things are going to be fun. I thought you were just mentally ill. Your Pokemon seem to really like you, so why don't you take the Pokemon Gym Challenge? If you manage to defeat all the gym leaders, you'll eventually challenge the Pokemon League Champion. Or not, because <laughs> you suck. Becoming the champion is not all easy, but you can certainly challenge Violet City's gym. Joe, challenging the gym scatter? Oh my god, dude. Okay, I get it. So you figure out what the fuck's up with that egg. You're differently different? <laughs> What's up, Eddie? Uh, yeah, it's not randomized. It's just a normal game. But... You know, still Nuzlocke, so he really does talk too much. And mom, go ahead and save my money. Because uh, she's really the only way you can get special items in this game, like choice band, choice scarf, and things like that. But now we can officially start our shit again. Yeah, man, we're Nuzlocke in everything. We've won. We've won. We're one and one so far. We, we beat the. What the hell? I didn't know she did that. When she, if you <laughs> if you did that around there, <laughs> that was funny. Bitch, <laughs> bitches ran around the sign. Oh my god, that was interesting. You can catch all the Pokemon with Pokeballs. Follow me, bitch. I already know that. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get our first encounter here. Oh wait, damn. No, I don't want to watch. Oh well, I guess we have to watch. In the original Hard Gold Sil I mean Gold and Silver, you didn't have to. But I guess in the remakes they made it a requirement. Um What's I saying? Oh yeah, so we're one in one so far. We we beat the fire red nuzlocke. We lost the emerald nuzlocke. I have them all, dude. I'm lucky I Started buying them right after high school. Because, dude, I saw... I went to the store the other day. 
because my brother was getting a game. And I saw Black 2 was selling for $80. 80 fucking dollars, dude. I was like, y'all are wilding out. Zoe Lama, welcome to the stream. Thank you for hosting. How you been, Joey? But yeah, dude, Pokemon games have gone up in price and it is ridiculous. Ben. <laughs> well, let me know uh, if you ever want to do something, Joe, and we'll get together on something. And we're going to get our first encounter here, and it is a Centric. So, we're just going to throw a Pokeball at this. Because uh, anything I hit it with, it's going to be dead. Hulkin Tournament? Alright, I'll see what I can do about that. I know, uh, I know Morgan likes to play that. You two bumping uglies? <laughs> no. What's the matter with you, Eddie? Alright, Sentry, let's see what your nickname's gonna be. You got an idea, anybody? Because I don't know what to name this trash. Sentry? Butt face. Alright, that works. <laughs> Eddie gave it the name, not me. Yeah, since you're just trash and you know it, I know it, everyone knows it. Alright, now we're going to activate the Charmander cheat. And, um, we're going to catch ourselves a Charmander, hopefully. Yeah, I'll give you that. Centred is cute. It's a cute Pokemon. And uh, we only have four Pokeballs, so I don't want to not catch a Charmander. This is the only Pokemon we could do this for. It's the action replay code for Charmander. Oh, and it's a female Charmander, too. Start getting nicknames ready. Well, it's a female Charmander. Alright, so we got one Rage off. I believe we should be able to do another Rage. Oh, yeah. There we go. Come on, Eddie. You gotta, you gotta give Charmander a respectable name, man. Not Flame Butt. So Charmander's in the red. Oh, but it broke out. See, th this is why I was worried. Charmander don't like Pokeballs. I mean, we could be basic and nickname it Charla. Aww. Priscilla? Alright, we'll go with that one. Priscilla it is. If we can catch it. Charmander, I only got four of these. Can you stay in the ball? If anything, we'll have to reset. Nope. Alright, reset time. Good thing we saved. Hope this doesn't take forever. For people on YouTube, that's going to be all. Everything's going to be cut till we catch one, I guess. But people on Twitch get to enjoy the, the pain and anguish with me. Alright, now we got a male Charmander, so we can just nickname it Natsu like we want want to do in the first place. All right, growl again. That's fine. All 
All right, take this damage. All right, I don't want to rage it again though, so. Yellow should be good enough. Let's go ahead and get it done. No! You should nickname every Pokemon after cereals. Oh, well, yeah, that could be a theme since we have Captain Crunch starting it off. Did he growl again? Because then we could rage. Yeah, let's rage. No! Alright. We only wasted one, two, wait, we wasted two Pokeballs there. Alright, let's go buy Pokeballs real quick. Pokeballs, balls, balls. Remember the good old days when the Pokemon Center and the Pokemart were two different places? Alright, buy 10. Added Premier Ball. And I don't know why I didn't just buy them all at the same time. Can I sell something so I can potentially get three more Pokeballs? Nope. Okay. Oh well. Alright, buy the rest. Because we're going to need these Pokeballs. All right, uh, so what cereal should we name Charmander after? Oatmeal, since it's a hot cereal. <laughs> oh, man. All right, I'm going to save again. I mean, it makes sense. You know what? That's it. Oatmeal. It, it's it. It makes the most sense. Oatmeal. It is. We're going oatmeal. Hopefully, Scratch doesn't kill this thing. It is level four. All right. So we'll get a rage off. Should leave it in the red. All right, perfect. Oatmeal at Ia. Yeah, oatmeal at Ia. <laughs> and we're going to give it a Premier Ball. Maybe it likes the Premier Ball better. It has that red stripe. Very fashionable. Okay, never mind. Fuck you, Tarmander. All right, let's see. We got 20 Pokeballs. It's got a catch and one. Jesus Christ, it's not even shaking. Oh my God. Come on. Well, oh, guys, have y'all seen that new Mortal Kombat movie? I haven't. Is it good? You're busting my balls here, Charmander. Literally. Stop busting out. Bastard. But nobody likes you. That sounds like a good time, doesn't it? Pokeball, go! Good God. Don't even shake. Oh, you saw the Demon Slayer movie? How was that? Oh, it was lit. <laughs> I've never watched Demon Slayer, so I don't mind spoilers. And I don't know if anyone here doesn't want spoilers, but that's their problem.
time and understand the fucking Pokeball. Jesus Christ. You know what's not lit? This Charmander not wanting to get caught. That's the opposite of lit. That's dull. That's dull and stupid. Oh my goodness, dude. What do I gotta do to make this Charmander stay in the ball? A thousand Pokeballs later. Charmander doesn't want to be caught in a ball. Let's just say a good guy dies. Oh! You don't normally see that in, in uh, what she calls it, animes. I wish I had a Master Ball. I should have ginned one into the game. I didn't think that far ahead, so... Uh, let's see, y'all. Pokeball, go! Fuck you, dude. I can't even speed up either. Ridiculous. I'm doing all the button tricks, too. Oh, fuck you, dude! It shook three times! You know what? This is bullshit. Fuck you, Charmander. Hope you drown. Wow. Now it doesn't even want to stay in the ball. I'm going to drown you personally. Off screen. And I got a water type. So I can do it. Did he just growl twice? I think he growled twice. He's cheating now. I should have titled this, Watch Me Not Catch a Charmander, for four hours. So many Pokeballs wasted. Wow, dude. Woo. So Demon Slayer, what's that about? Charmander, if you don't stay in this Pokeball, I'm gonna punch you in the gut. Finally! Somebody wanna clip that? He finally catches the damn thing. The flame on its tail shows the strength of its life force. If it's weak, the flame also burns weakly. So it burns once a week, or what? Alright, so Natsu is... Oh, wait, no. Oatmeal. Oatmeal. Took so damn long, I almost forgot. Alright, Oatmeal. It's time. Slaying demons? Oh, I, I thought it was deeper than that. <laughs> oh, hell, King Oatmeal! Oh, hell, the King! Fucking Oatmeal. I would hope you're not fucking oatmeal. Alright. So, Buttface is clearly gonna be an HM slave. And we gotta get oatmeal up some levels. Oh, look at that cute Charmander! Charmander! Jimmy! I got a Charmander! Oh, he's happy. He loves the smell of flowers. Oh, hold on. Before I continue. I need to go to the cheats list and 
remove the Charmander thing now. We don't need it. Save. Boom. Okay, so now there should be no more Charmanders in the wild. Oh, well, there's a Charmander in the wild. Maybe it's going to take a minute for the cheat to go away. But... It's okay. We need to switch train anyways, and this is an easy kill. Ah, so it is deeper than that. Well, I think it's been long enough since the King Kong versus Godzilla fight. What did y'all think of that? Have y'all seen that? The basic plot is the main character's family dies to a demon except one of his sisters, which becomes a demon. Oh shit, that's a fucking plot twist. I bet you don't find that out for a while, huh? No, find it out right away. Scratch. That's how the conversations go in my head, by the way, everybody. No, yeah, stupid, no. It's not, it's not that difficult. Oh, he's on a mission to get her back to normal. Interesting. So I guess he has to kill demon, the original person who made her a demon to free her soul or some shit. So, sounds like uh, the traditional thing that happens when a demon possesses somebody or something. Then you got to kill that demon. Oh, okay. So you do find it in the same episode. Is that like the pilot episode? Do they just fucking flat out, oh, alright, your whole family's dead, your sister's a demon, um, best of luck to you? Or is it like, they build up to it little by little? Because my brother said he, he wasn't too into Demon Slayer, but his friends love it. Alright guys, before we take on, um, wait, no, you know what, the trainers I think we could take on already. It shouldn't be too difficult. Um, we're gonna go ahead and scratch the shit out of this Pidgey though. I'm gonna scratch at it like it's an STD. Okay, so Oatmeal is on a mission here. Level 5! Oatmeal's gonna make this game so much easier. Okay, so it was the first episode. So the art, the action of the art style was great? Or just the action itself? We got a ratata! Look at you, Ratata. Die to a scratch. I'll give it a shot. I still gotta finish Fairy Tale. Alright, so we got two defense drops. And as long as he doesn't have quick attack, we should be fine. Alright, so Rattata goes down finally. And Oatmeal wins his first trainer battle. Oh, the art style. Okay. That's good. I didn't like... Uh, I don't know. I don't like the art style for the Sun and Moon series of Pokemon. I know it's been out a while and all that jazz. But I just don't like it. It looks... Ugh. Gross. But I get it. It's not for me. So, you know. It is what it is. Oh, then I will like that. I love funny moments at the most inappropriate timing. I like when it's like a serious moment and someone's just like, Uh, is this that serious? Alright, so Oatmeal's gonna take down a Pidgey. The way I'm saying it, it's like you're throwing Oatmeal at a Pidgey. Like, fuck you, here's my breakfast! Ugh! 
And then Pidgey's just like, Pop! Yeah, dude, I'm like on season five of Fairy Tales. Four more se seasons to go. It's a good show. It's just the power of friendship stuff that gets irritating sometimes. It's like, we get it. Y'all all love each other like family. So what? Other than that, you know, not a bad show. They do have fanfare like a motherfucker, though. They ship everybody and all that stuff, so. There's something to it. They certainly like to show off the boobies. Oatmeal learned Ember so it could warm itself up. Damn it. I have missed an opportunity here, guys. Once I get a chance, I'm going to change uh, Oatmeal's nickname. I know what I should have named it. I should have named it Quaker. Quaker Oats. It's Oatmeal, but it's the brand name of Oatmeal. Of an oatmeal company. You know what I mean. Oh, we got a mild nature too. I think that's plus defense minus something. No shit, Joe. Okay, cool. So it's plus special attack minus defense. So that's not too bad. We ain't gonna be taking no hard physical hits, but it's cool. Instead of bug Pokemon, I found a trainer. Oh, yeah, you found a trainer with the Charmander, though. So you're fucked. Um, oh, by the way, Eddie, I don't know if you were here when I said this, but I added some new stuff to the stream. Uh, the Say It Live, where you can send in bits to make the robot say something on stream. And then there's the feature viewer. So if anyone wants to promote themselves, they can. With bits, of course. And then... We have sound alerts where it's really cheap if you pay bits for that. Uh, you can uh, spam noises and stuff on stream. Um, Caterpie, let's go ahead and ember you too. Down goes that boy right there. And we get to level 8, so we're caught up on oatmeal. Alright, so now we're going to make our way to Violet City. Ooh, Spinarak. I believe this is our first encounter on this route. So, let's go ahead and get a scratch off. No, we killed it! Critical hit! I don't know what a bit is. A bit of my nuts. <laughs> no, it's a... Uh, bits are basically something you can buy here on Twitch and send in. Like, uh, basically 100 bits is a dollar. But most of the stuff I have is like 50 bits. So like 50 cents to make a noise or something like that. Not too crazy. Alright, so we're going to try to get a Pokemon in here. I'm going to put Captain Crunch up because it could be a Rock-type Pokemon. And it is! We get... Uh, but the thing is, I don't think we can evolve it though, so that's going to suck. But, let's go ahead and try to catch it anyway. So we're gonna have to trade off some attacks here, cause uh, it's the best we got. Best we got, fam. All 
Alright, one more hit should be enough. Oh, defense girl. How cute. Alright, now it's it's low. Let's just go ahead and throw a Pokeball. We only got three. Thanks to fucking Charmander being a dickhead. And let's go ahead scratch again. Because for some reason, I just don't want to get stuck in the ball. So we're going to attack you one more time. Should get you in the red from there. And there you go. Oh, also, you can even use Z-Bucks for some of the stuff, I think. And that doesn't cost you a dime. You get Z-Bucks just for watching, so. I mean, you get Z-Bucks, like, getting subscriptions and stuff. But just watching, you forget free Z-Bucks. Then you can use those free Z-Bucks to do whatever you want. Alright, so we got Geodude. And I honestly don't want to use Geodude on the team. But we'll go ahead. Let's see what we can name this. We'll name it Coco Pebble. Coco Pebble. Ah, oh, shit. Can't afford a space. Ah! Pebble. Alright, Coco Pebble. There we go. Hey, Joey. I'm not gonna answer your call. Whoa! What just happened here? Alright, so that's scary. I'm gonna save just in case. game trying to spaz out on us already you're not supposed to have a Charmander I know I'm sorry give me that we found a pokeball all right let's see is this a new route I think it is I caught a bunch of Pokemon let me battle with you okay sure why not Dick. All right, so Oatmeal's gonna make a little bar bug barbecue here. <sighs> All right. So, anyone got anyone got any idea uh, how far y'all think we'll make it in this Nuzlocke? I think we win it all. And I'm not even just being biased. I just mean like this game is fairly easy on the levels. Battles are pretty decent. They're not too tough. I think we'll we'll run it through. And then with Charmander, the first two gyms are going to be really fucking easy. Sure. Let's get let's share the let's share the number. I remember back in the gold and silver days, uh, you only had a limited amount of room in your phone, so. Once you get towards the end of the game and you want to get, like, new people's numbers, it was like, oh, sorry, whoever you are. I'm going to have to delete your number because uh, I want this person's number instead. Uh-oh. I knew it was you, Joe. How'd you get past me? Here's something neat for surprising me, Joe. Joe, obtain the Versus Seeker. <laughs> the Versus Seeker? Oh, how I missed thee. Gen 8 does not have the Versus Seeker, and it really hurts my heart.
in my shield nuzlocke, I literally pulled some stupid ass mistakes. I already have like nine or ten deaths. You lost an axe, you! Damn, dude. That that's that's horrible. And it's just A X E W. Oh, okay, so we're gonna leave those Pokemon with us because we need fodder mines just in case. You know, not gonna not gonna stay empty-handed here. Okay, I gotta remember to check real quick. Poke gear. All right, so that's Route Thirty One. Dark Cave, Route 30. Okay, so that's a different route. So I can catch Pokemon here. Oh, you know what? I need to go get Pokeballs. My bad. Pokeballs, balls, balls. You and me, baby, we're nothing but mammals, so let's get some Pokeballs and catch the Pokemon. Oh, wow. Can only afford one. Wow, we broke his shit. Holy fuck. You and me, baby, we're broke as fuck. Let's go rob a bank and maybe get shot. Who knows? Uh, we seriously need some money, though. But let's hope uh, three Pokeballs is enough to catch whatever we're supposed to catch here. Woo -hoo. Oh shit, we got ourselves a hoot hoot, everybody. And I think I already know... Well, it's, I mean, well, I know what the nickname is, but it's not going to fit as cleverly as uh, if we're playing Sun and Moon. Eddie, can you look up if there's a owl ch owl cereal, like a knockoff brand? And a double battle against a freaking Togetic, and I thought I could one-hit KO it with Poison Jab. It lived in Fairy Winded, instant KO'd my Axew. Damn. Well, if you didn't have bad luck, you would have no luck at all. It always stands on one foot. It's changed its feet so fast, the movement can rarely be seen. Where's his other foot then? Alright, let's go ahead and nickname this thing something. I always like to nickname it Hooters, but since we're going for a cereal theme here. Uh, Owl Cereal. Are you serious? <laughs> uh, there is... Alright, well I guess that's a thing. Or we're gonna go with that. Uh, apparently Kellogg's has one that's called Coco Hoots. Cheery Owls? Yeah, you know what, let's do Cheery Owls. We already have a Coco Pebble. Okay, so let's go cheer. Damn, it fit perfectly. Coco hoots, yeah. It's like what? What the hell y'all doing? Cheery Owls is the name, and I still don't think we're going to be using that one either. Oh, man. All these Pokemon that are trash. I was hoping for, like, a Bell Sprout or something. Still out our water, water fire grass core or something. 
Uh, I guess it is nighttime in the game. All right, time to take on Sprout Tower. Um, let's go ahead and put oatmeal up front because clearly Camp Crunch ain't gonna be who we playing around with in here. Whoa. This game is glitching. Uh, it does, this game don't like the Sprout Tower, clearly. I'm gonna go ahead and save again. However hard we battle, the tower will stand strong. I hope so. Shit. Don't make me get OSHA on your ass. Bell Sprout, Bell Sprout. Charmander uses Ember, and Oko's the Bell Sprout. Another Bell Sprout to be torn down here. All right, guys, what's been on y'all's mind? How have y'all been feeling this Monday? We're gonna have something to talk about here because these uh, Bell Sprouts are going down. I watch any good TV shows, any movies, politics. I'm just kidding. Don't talk about politics. I don't understand it. Um, I don't know. What video games have y'all been playing? Obviously, I've been playing Pokemon over here. Does anyone have any experience? Oh, my God. What is going on here? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Hopefully it doesn't fuck up the game. Day 11 without your wife? Holy shit, dude. I thought she was getting cleared of her COVID. Does she have to wait the whole two weeks? Pokemon, baby! <laughs> I like how you transition from day 11 without my wife. But Pokemon, dude! I've been playing Pokemon! Holy shit, dude. What Pokemon games you've been playing? You've been playing along with me, or are you just playing uh, Nuzlocke on the, on the shield? On the sword and shield? So far, so good. Uh, oatmeal should be probably level 13 by the... Oh, man. I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, Charmander. Oh, here we go. First encounter in here. And it's a Ghastly! Woo! Finally a Pokemon worthy of adding to the team! Well, hopefully she comes out of it soon. Whatever's going on. All right, Ghastly, we can't really hit. We have nothing to hit it with. Oh, you know what? Okay, worthless. Cheerios, what you got? Cheery Owls. Okay, cool. So we're going to go Cheery Owl. Because it's the only thing... We have to hit this thing. Oh, we can even hypnosis it. Oh, shit. Cheery Owl's coming in clutch. All right. Now we can foresight here. Oh, yeah. Plus, that, that Nuzlocke is 
probably plenty of fun that you need right now. Alright, so Ghastly going for that lick, 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 lick. But this ain't no cat Pokemon. Don't want no lick. We're gonna hypnosis it as well. Because uh, we need everything we can to make sure we catch this Ghastly here. Bruh. Oh shit, we have Insomnia. This hoot hoot is perfect for Ghastly. I guess that's why Ash used it. Oh, we're definitely naming this Boo Berry. Alright, Ghastly. Come in the ball, please. I wasn't even worried. With this gas-like body, it can sneak into any place it desires. However, it can be blown away by the wind. Give Ghastly a name? Yeah! Booberry. Dang, all these serial names are just fitting inside. Alright, so now let's go ahead and continue on. Oh shit, I forgot to get the item. We already caught one of you. We don't need you anymore. Leave. I probably am going to start switch training this, uh, this thing though. Because we want to get it usable as fast as possible. Sorry, Totodai, you kind of took a step back there, dude. Ugh, sorry, I'm burping so much. Um, let's see. So we got Booberry again. And we'll go Captain Crunch here to fight these wild animals. Cause this has got water gun. Oh yeah, critical hit. Ooh, and just enough to get it to level nine as well. Does it get bite? Nope, not quite yet. All right, so we got another battle here. And switch training is going to be a pain in the fucking ass. I already know it. In the fucking ass over here. Alright, Ember time. Bell sprout, bell sprout, bell sprout. Ooh, Booberry ID level 5? Hell yeah, I'll take that. Alright, let's go back to Booberry so we can get him some more EXP. Hopefully get to level 6. Oh no, we're, we're far away from level 6. Can I get a honey y'all? Honey y'all! Oh, speaking of honey y'all, I gotta get my... I gotta get my newest, uh... My newest things updated. My newest emojis. So of course y'all seen those three. I had a few other ones commissioned. So expect to see some new some new uh emojis coming soon. Don't forget to subscribe to be able to use those. Alright, bell frown, bell frown. Oh shit, I forgot to switch out. It's okay. Oatmeal needs the XP anyway. Alright, so what level... What level is the first gym in this game? I, I totally forgot to check about that. Um, Pokemon, Heart, Gold. 
gym leaders. Looking for the gym leaders. Alright, so his top Pokemon is level 13. So we're good to get about there. Jesus, that was annoying me. Alright, here we go. Alright, Eddie, I'll be here. Wake up, stupid! Alright, so we still got a few more battles to go here, and then we gotta battle the main guy. Wife's calling. Wife is calling. Bellsprout. Alright, so level 6 Bellsprout. Gonna give off some good EXP this time. See, this is what I mean. The levels are so low. I mean, granted, you know, they don't want to over-level us before the first gym, but it's like, come on, man. We got, we have a full team of six Pokemon already. So, like, give us some, give us some options here. Whoa, I mean, I'm squirt. That's weird. One of the guys says, oh, I squirted, or something like that. I was like, the fuck? You, sir, keep it in your pants. And we got another Bellsprout coming out right here right now. The level 6 Bellsprout. And, of course, Oatmeal is just going to come out here and flame up. Ember attack these fools. Oh no, good to level 12. Almost level 13. Okay, well, let's go ahead and battle this guy. I think he has a bell sprout first and a hoot hoot. Blueberry is on the field, but oatmeal is making an appeal. Get it? Because you can put bananas in oatmeal. Ember attack! Fuck your growth. You are in our future, Bell Sprout. Bell Sprout. Bell Sprout. Alright, we got Mean Look coming in. Hoot hoot! Alright, so we're gonna go to Boo Berry here. And then go out to the other guy. Camp Crunch. And then Camp Crunch is going to deal with that hoot hoot. <laughs> Big Scratch coming off against the hoot hoot, but Tackle comes back at us. We lose 4 HP, but that's nothing compared to what he's losing. And, oh, Hypnosis, though, is going to put a damper on our spirits and make us a little bit sleepy there. Wake up, Crunch. Ooh, and now the Growl is coming off. That's just Water Gun now. Wake up, Crunch! Normally you wake up and then have some Camp Crunch. Camp Crunch is just sleeping on the job. Water gun comes off though. Finally, after the third turn. And down goes the hoot hoot. Alright, we're finally about to face the boss. <coughs> Excuse me. We're about to face the boss. You showed us. 
what you've got, and it is indeed good. Take this technical machine. However, you should care more about your Pokemon. The way you treat your Pokemon can be too harsh. Remember, Pokemon are not tools of war. <laughs> he calls himself the Elder, but he was no match for me. Sure enough, those who lecture how you should be nice to Pokemon, they cannot defeat me. All I care about are how strong Pokemon... Wait, hold on. I, I put how in there for some reason. All I care about are strong Pokemon that win every time. The rest of them don't mean nothing to me. Will used an escape rope. Alright, well, he dipped out quicker than you can say he dipped out. Um, escape rope comes through, though, because we're about to use one, too. After we beat the Elder. Ghastly, look, I'm really sick of your shit. Can you not come around right now? Captain Crunch time. That was inadvertently a badass nickname I just gave him. Captain Crunch time. Whenever you need something to happen in a crunch, you call Captain Crunch. And it'll be Captain Crunch time. Okay, Captain Crunch, wake the fuck up. You're being Captain Illiterate right now. I don't know why I said illiterate. Annoying, for sure. All the way to the fifth turn. You're trash. And you couldn't even take out a measly ghastly? Come on, man. What do I pay you for? Alright! Time to face the old... Excuse me. So good of you to come here. Sprite Tower is a place of training. People in Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I am the final test. Allow me to check the ties between you and your Pokemon. Alright. Sure, Jesus. Bellsprout. Bellsprout. Alright. Bellsprout's coming out hot. But oatmeal's hotter! Time to get that. Time to get that amber going. Down you go, Bell Sprout. Blueberry's level 9. And who who is coming out? I'm not gonna switch train right here. Cause Captain Crunch needs to get this kill. Oh and of course hypnosis comes off. That's annoying. Alright, let's go ahead and try to wake up and scratch. No. Alright, he goes for Peck. That's fine, we could take that. Wake up, go for Scratch. And that does a good amount of damage as he pecks us again. Now, let's get the Scratch off and hope he doesn't go Hypnosis here. Yeah, he goes Peck, but we need a heal. Because uh, a crit will do us in like you won't believe. He got the crit. What a fucking bastard. Can we get a crit? No, of course not. But at least his hypnosis misses, so we can take out the hoot hoot now. Bitch. And we get to level 10. Beautiful. Is it crunch time? Nope. Bell Sprout comes in, so we're going to go ahead and switch to Boo Bear here. And then switch back into Charmander and get that final KO. Oatmeal. Oatmeal.
And down he goes! Oh, excellent! Hmm, the way you battle is quite elegant. You should be able to stand up to Faulkner. And you should be able to make good use of this. It is the technical machine called Flash. Take it with you. We got the goddamn thing right here, boy. Alright, time to escape rope out. Because there's too many Pokemon to encounter in here. Oh! Alright, time to go to the Pokemon Center. Look at your mama bit. She got a splinter. Okay, I'll take the Pokemon for a few seconds. And let's see. Booberry, what ability do you have? Naughty nature. Naughty, naughty. Naughty, naughty. Alright, so it's plus attack minus special defense. Could have been better. Could have definitely been better. But we work with what we got. So now, we'll be putting Captain Crunch up front. And we'll have Oatmeal come in here. Uh, Booberry is mainly going to be a Hypnosis Mon. Why does it keep doing that? It's making me noivous. It's making me noivous, man. Alright. Joe, save the game. you damn right, dude. So now we can access the gym. And let's go ahead and, and take on the gym trainers first because we need Totodile to get up a few levels, if we're being honest. If we're being completely honest. Ooh, and only one Pokemon to battle here. Let's go for the scratch! Dang, Fury Attack! Calm down, dude. All right, let's get another scratch going. Leer. Fuck off, dude. Go for Leer again, please. Okay. Can I please still take him out? Okay, good. Woo! That made me annoy this! Keep going, keep going. All the way, all the way. Ah, oh, fuck off. You could have made me... Level 11. You just don't want to. Alright, we're gonna heal up a little bit, a little bit. And take on this guy. Oh, some kind of big shot. We'll see what happens if you get pushed around up here. Think you'll stagger and fall? People here are training night and day to become bird Pokemon masters. Bring it on. This is talking about murder. He wants us to he wants to push us off this bridge. Can't front don't taste too nightly to murderers. Damn, alright, here we go. Scratch that. All on the flow, scratch that, pidgey some more. Crit! Oh yeah! Got a crit. Critical hit. Alright, so Pidgey's coming out again. Get that scratch. Scratch, scratch, scratch to the max. Oh, he hit me with stand attack. Oh no, no. No, you don't. Scratch to death. 
Hell yeah. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get everyone to level 13. I'm gonna play it safe. I don't want to lose to the first Pokemon gym right away. Right now. So, come with me and you'll see a world of pure domination as we kill some Pokemon in the grass. Faint. Damn, it didn't faint. Maybe we'll get a, uh, maybe we'll get a, a, what do you call it? A shiny too. You never know. Heart Gold, or I think it's Heart Gold, is the first Pokemon game I actually got a shiny in. So, shout out to that. First it was, uh, coughing. Beautiful green with purple smoke. And then I got, uh, what do you call it? I got a drowsy right after that. Same game, same time frame. I wasn't even trying, I was just looking for a ditto. And then, boom! He was like, you looking for me, fam? I was like, no. But, uh, I got a Pokeball with your name on it. Level 12 is what I am. Alrighty then. I should have been writing down time. <laughs> so I can make editing easier on myself. And I didn't. So, I'm full up. <clears throat> Alright, this should take out the bell sprout. I'm not too worried about a wild bell sprout. Oh, okay. That did nothing. Maybe I shouldn't have been so worried at the Ghost Rock Tower. Down frown, down frown. And again. A whole two damage. What is wrong with me? I don't know. Hell, hoot, hoot. Scratch. Oh, my God. Damn, I still didn't do enough. Level 5 hoo hoo and for what? <clears throat> Don't yell at me. You dare yell at me. I own you! Oh, there's the crit. 
There's a crit we've been fishing for. Can you see the critical hit? It's attacking it. Something, something, something. Damn, scratch is not enough for some reason. Ratatata. Bruh, this is taking forever. Let me go heal. Black Apricorn. I uh, wonder what what Pokeball that gives us. Whoa! I'm sparse. I'm looking for you. Ah! There's a Totodile attacking. All right, you did, you did. You. Yeah, let's 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 get out of the cave. Come back over here. Someone tried to post the link. That didn't work. Doesn't even look like a real account either. Well, Captain Crunch is our first Pokemon on level 13. Who would learn fight? Oh, yeah. Thank you. Yas, please. You were the rage. And we learned a little body bite. All right. And then we're going to go ahead and get oatmeal up to the level. And then uh, blueberry. Uh, I don't know, man. I don't know if I want to take the time to do that for you. Sorry, sorry, very sorry. Water gun. Oh, shit. Sorry. No, your oatmeal. Oatmeal. There you go. La 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 la. Losing my fucking mind. As we scratch, 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 scratch the rattata. That rattata used quick attack. That was the first Pokemon to use quick attack in this game. All right, so Oatmeal is going to go ahead and just Ember this thing. And down goes the Bell Sprout. Is that enough? Is that enough? It is. Beautiful. Now we're going to take on the gym. Like I said, I don't, I don't know. Let's see how, uh, let's see how Blueberry does against the first Pokemon. Damn, I have nothing for this. Yep, run. It's okay, we'll get Booberry experience one way or another.
Probably more switch training after the gym. Let's go ahead and lead Captain Crunch. Oh, let's go heal. I did use a couple of embers in there. Okay. All right, here we go. Gym battle time. Man, I don't have William here to clip. I'm Faulkner, the Violet City Pokemon Gym Leader. People say you can clip flying types, Pokemon's wings with the jolt of electricity. I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of the magnificent bird Pokemon. You are challenged by Leader Faulkner. Oh shit, he got himself a Pidgey. Pidgey boy, Pidgey boy. Let's go ahead and get that flinch. Oh yeah, Pidgey flinch. Alright, so Pidgey goes down. No fucking problem. Pidgeotto's coming in. The wind is finally with us. Dude, it's the last Pokemon. Pidgeotto is faster and he goes Gust. But we go Bite and it does just about amount, bleh, just about as much damage. He goes Roost. And we're going to go Bite again. Alright, so now I'm going to go Leer. Since he's going roost. And I'm gonna lock him into the gust roost, gust roost, gust roost. And we should get it to enough points where we should be able to knock him out with the bite here in a little bit. And uh, we have a chance to heal up if we need to. So bite does that only that much more. So Pidgeot goes for a second gust here. Not the roost, but we went for the bite anyway. We can still fly. All right, that means he's going to potion up. So we're going to go ahead and potion up. Oh, he used Gus. He didn't potion. Well, that just means... Oh, okay. We can take him out with Bite now. Oh, he went Roost. Shit. Smart man. Smart man. Alright. Bite should take it out from here. Oh, Roost. I should have known. Well, either way, we'll leer it next turn. Welcome back, Eddie. You're just in time to watch us uh, leer at this Pidgeotto. And I'm going to leer one more time. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Roost. Ha! Pathetic. Oh, my phone died. Here we go. I'm going to bite here. Oh, wow. I got a damage roll like you won't believe. Uh, I don't want to risk the crit. Potion up, baby. All right, he goes Gust again. And Bite should do it. Holy fucking shit! Fuck 
you! Critical hit! Living on one HP. Whew. Oh boy! That was almost bad. That was almost really bad. Cam Crunch said, fuck you for that. But we do get our first badge. Alright, now that we have the Zephyr badge, we can go ahead and add it to... Oh shit. Boom! There we go. Now the bottom doesn't look so empty no more, does it? With that badge, Pokemon include a traded Pokemon up to level 20. will obey you without question. It also enables you to use the hidden move Rock Smash anytime outside of battle. And we get TM-51, Aerial Ace. No, Roost. My bad. My bad. Thought he was giving us a, a useful move. Turned out it was just a useless fucking move. Professor Elm, what great timing. Hello, Joe. We've discovered something. The details are, well... I can't really say anything, but we want you to carry that egg. My assistant is at the Pokemart in Violet City. Could you meet him and pick up that egg? No. Daddy is not my job. Just kidding. Dude, a Togetic? Fuck yeah, I'm gonna take that. The only annoying part is it only involves the friendship stuff. So. Gonna have to deal with that bullshit. Alright. Now we're gonna go ahead and put Ghastly up front so we can actually gain some levels with that thing. And that's where we'd go if we had a Bell Sprout so we can get an Onyx. But that's not the case. Ooh, we got a super potion from Mother. Mother! Then I say not to walk my way. Or something like that. I don't know. Well, fuck you, dude. I don't want to... I got to go back to the Pokemon Center. But, um... Here we go. Is everything okay, Eddie? How insensitive of me not to ask that. Alright, someone's PC. Deposit the Pokemon. So we can get rid of Butt Face, because we don't need it. And we're gonna get rid of. We're gonna get rid of Geodude. Coco Pebble. Because we don't need it. Gotta have my pops! Can't wait to catch a Mareep and name it that. Pops. Dan Zig sucks anyway? Who's Dan Zig? Alright, thank you. Um, shut up, dude. I don't care. I don't fucking care. Thank you. Leave my sight. Um, who else thought when they were younger, if you put... Oh my goodness. Me, oh my. That egg must be... I see. So it was handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm. Then from Professor Elm to you. Who the fuck are you and how do you know this information? Now I get it. That egg is a truly important egg. Please do take good care of it for me. That understood? No, bitch. I don't even know who you are. I am counting on you. Bro, you better go get uh, Count Chocula or something. Get the fuck out of here. Oh. <laughs> I don't know, man. I I just like that song. But I don't know what it's like. 
and you play that role with me. And I show you what it's like. Bro, you are worthless. Did he have a mask? What a fucking loser. Yo, haven't you had trouble with the boulder blocking your way? Of course you have. For people like you, there's an HM that will come to your rescue. And this is where you get Rock Smash. Talking about boulders, but he gives you a rock smash instead of strength. Hey, get it? Get it? Oh yeah, get it, 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 uh. Dance with the pseudo. Dance with the pseudo. Wooda wooda wooda. Dance with the pseudo wooda 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 do 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 wow. Alright, pseudo wooda. I'm bored of you. Let's go. I have a water Pokemon. Can I just like splash him with the water? She going to do one more MRI tonight, and if something goes well, she'll be going home in the morning, Lord willing. Yeah, hopefully, man. Hopefully. Prayers out to that. Did you see that strange tree in the road? That may explain why fewer people are visiting the ruins about. Shut up, old man. You old turd. Alright. Okay, well. This place is pointless. So you know. Except for this part right here. Alright. The puzzle's on the bottom, so it, it might be hard for y'all to see. But, it's as easy as one, two, three. Shit, wrong. <laughs> Stupid ass. I'm gonna call it easy and do it wrong. <laughs> now we're gonna fall through the floor. And then this guy's gonna be like, you don't know what you've done. You've unlocked something. And then we'll be able to catch unknowns now. So basically, he just gives you a thing that keeps track of what letters you get. I have to, man. Oh, look, it's an E for Eddie. Hey, gang, gang. There you go, Eddie. You get your own special, uh... <laughs> I don't. Ah, Booberry, you suck. Don't be psychic. Okay, well, it's not normal and it's not fighting, because it hit. But let's go ahead and get Hypnosis off. Unknown is here with me. Gonna lick it up because it's an E. I guess. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know what you want from me. Unknown came to me. I didn't come to it. I just want to do the puzzle. Stay asleep. There we go. I need to get more Pokeballs now that I think about it. One Pokeball. Will it capture the E? Will it break free? Who cares? It's an unknown. And we catch it. Okay, whatever. Can you say Foddermon? Because that's what this thing is. It's a Foddermon. Yeah, we're going to name it Eddie because it starts with an E. All right, Eddie, you're on the team. You're on the squad. Welcome, welcome all. Welcome to the stream. Now we got an A. Hidden power hit, so it's not fighting or normal. Whoa! Fuck 
you do? Okay, so we lost a Pokemon to unknown. Uh, should I retire Nuzlocking now or now? Fuck you! He would have a fucking ghost or psychic type move. You know what? Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck the fuck off. Yeah, you? Hey, fuck off. God damn it. I wanted Gasly. Jesus Christ. You shit, man. Wow. That's depressing. Talking about shooting yourself in the foot. Well, no more ghastly. Let's go get some Pokeballs. Let's go get some Pokeballs. Holy fucking shit. Alright, so... 10. And a Premier Ball as a gift. Let's see, do we have something to sell? Nope. I mean, we could sell Roost, but... We'll keep it for now. Not Boo Berry. I know, man. Boo Berry was gonna be clutch. But sadly, it is not meant to be. We lose Boo Berry to a bullshit fucking unknown yeah all right okay booberry looks like you suffer in the box now you know what fuck you. you you'll never see the light of day it's all your fault e you know i thought Ah, what are the chances unknown are gonna have the hidden power psychic or ghost? This is free EXP for for Booberry here. And nope. Straight up fuck you from the game. We got a whooper! Um a little bit of scratch. I hope so. Stop, 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 stop. Okay. Alright, so much sport comes off, but I mean, we ain't gonna like type anyway, so I'm not worried about it. So, use the Pokeball. You got damn right. So now we gotta... We still have a chance to get a Marie. Um, but what should we name Whooper? I don't know if uh, there's anything to fit the cereal for this thing. Oh, fuck. I hope it's not the catch for this route. Um. I don't know a name for this thing. What do I call it? Fruity Pebble? Or what? <laughs> what do I name it? Flakes? Okay, cool. That works for me. Flakes. Not Frosted Flakes either. He's just a bland ass fucking cornflake. There we go. He's a cornflake. No! What could have been? See, you didn't love me enough, Marie. Fuck you. Dude, I got a place just to be. Can you not get in my way? Thank you. Oh my gosh, another 
Wooper is here. Oh, I need to put my glasses. It's bothering me now. <clears throat> Cornflake, you're bland as fuck. That's why you're a whooper. There we go. Much better. Alright, let's get oatmeal up front. And for those of you just joining us, we're naming our Pokemon after cereals. So that's why the names don't really make sense. And uh, what's Marie? What's what's Juino? Is that a, really a cereal? I haven't seen you around before. So you think you're pretty tough? Dude, I literally am walking around minding my own business. You came up to me. You must suffer the consequences of your arrogance. Ember for the win. Whooper's a bland Pokemon. That's why it's a, it's a flake. Alright, Ember attack. Oh, that Zubat is not going to enjoy the second one. Ember! <clears throat> oh, it's a substance for babies. Gotcha! Hey, that's clever. I never would have thought of baby cereal. Oh, that makes sense. <clears throat> Come on, the first piece of grass. That's, that's what well, could have been. Should we do a Marie clause? <laughs> uh, you must catch a Marie as well as a Charmander. I need that EXP though, so. Repel! Finally, dude. I'm gonna need to buy like a shit ton more of those. Oh my god. I hate this game. Why is there so many fucking wild Pokemon popping around? Alright. Well, at least we get to level 14. Two more levels and Charmander evolves. Four more levels and Crocodile Evolve. Oh my god, dude. Every step of the game. Alright, I'm running. No more no more point in uh, fighting Rattatus. Ah, I would, Eddie, but then it's not a Nuzlocke anymore. Uh-huh. Shut up. Prepare to lose, Nidoran Trainer. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and Ember. Let's go ahead and get another Ember off. Whoop, there it is. And let's hope we can catch a Drowsy on that one route so we can get Machop. Oh, you're on a big journey? Here, take my number. Maybe we could smash. Tele tele telephone. All right, here we go. Another fucking wild Pokemon. Whoa! Well, how's everyone's night going? While we try to run away from yet again another Pokemon. Oh my god! <laughs> I should just spray the repel. Uh, I'm gonna need it later. Okay, here we go. I can't wait to wait till we get to Azalea Town because that's when we can actually buy a bunch of them. A bunch of, uh. Dude, Switch. Fucking controller. A bunch of repels. If 
But again, guys, welcome if you are just joining us. We beat the first gym badge uh, very narrowly. I mean, not narrowly. We we're pretty commanding, actually. But he got like a last second crit that left us on one HP. Which would have been bad if he survived the next hit, but he didn't. And then, uh... We've just been grinding ever since. We lost a gas lead to an unknown. Uh, I think most of y'all were here for that. Um, and, uh... Again, this is the Nuzlocke, so... Since Ghastly went down, we're kind of shit out of luck at that point. And here we go with the Hypnosis. Hey, look! Polywag is cross-eyed. But yeah, guys, nonetheless, we did get our first gem badge. And we're working our way towards the second one. We'll be streaming for another two hours, about. And we're going to slowly but surely grind through this game. All them bubbles making me slow. Literally. And in the game. Splish splash, I was taking a bath. All about a Saturday night. It was glib glub. <clears throat> Onyx would have been perfect for Pebbles, yeah. Onyx could have been Pebbles, but we didn't get a Bell Sprout. And now, um, Captain Crunch is eating Magikarps. Okay, so Magikarp is splish splashing, taking a bath as we bite its tail. Oh my god, that's 15? Level 15? Holy shit, dude. Machop bootios? Bro, now I really want to catch a Machop. That is hilarious. I didn't even think about that. I'm going to need you to send these to me later, just in case I forget. Captain Crunch wants to learn scary face. No. Give up on it. You're not scary face. You're too cute. Alright, uh, oatmeal. You can take down a magic art. Holy cheat. Magikarp goes down. Do they all say splash? That's annoying. You could actually avoid this trainer if you wanted to, but I didn't want to. I don't think Machop's in that cave. I think you can only get it through trade or like later, later in, in another cave. I just hope, for the love of God, I don't get a Zubat. Yeah, Ralph, I'll take your number. No, I know it's real. I've seen it. <laughs> Trust me, I know what it is. That's why I'm like, that's awesome. I, I should have thought of that. Bodios. Shut up, Ralph. You disgust me. I bet your own kids don't even have your number. And another whooper. How can you be so mean? mean? 
All right, fight. So the second gym has Pokemon leveled highest level 17, and Fury Cutter can get dangerous. So that's that's the target level for our Pokemon. Okay, let's go ahead and make our way downtown, walking fast, faces fast, and I'm homebound. Alright, oatmeal, go ahead and get that level. Oh, give me that. Ah, oh, damn it! I was trying to make it through. Make your way through the crowd. Scratch. And scratch again. I'm telling you guys, this game is amazing. Love this game. I love the storyline in this game too. The fact that Team Rocket's trying to come back. It's like, holy shit. Dude, what the fuck? I just battled something. Fuck off. Alright, there. Happy? Shit. Intriguing. Go fuck yourself, picnicker. Or camper. Whatever you are. Ember to the face. I want a Nidoran. I want a Nidoran so bad. But there's only one place you can catch it. And then you can't get a Moonstone to after you beat the 8th gym. So it's kind of worthless to get a Nidoran. I think there's another battle over here too. Dear God, all these, uh, note to self, don't run in the grass. I think that increases your chances of getting a in wild encounter. Whoa, what was that? No. At least give me a shiny Pokemon if you're not going to pop up this fucking much. Ooh, great ball. My balls are great. My balls are great. Hey look, a Zubat. Worthless fucking Pokemon. Yay! We made it out of the grass. Fuck off, fatty. That'll be in our goddamn way. Hey, I said Zubat is the most worthless Pokemon. Crobat is actually worth something. But it's still a Zubat, so it's worthless. Don't at me! All right, old rod. I'll take the old rod. Whoa, hold on a minute. That's a trap. I'm not taking the old rod at all. Get away from me, creepo. At Joe. You see that creep? He wanted to give me his old rod. What a perv. It's looking weird, man. Stranger danger, man! Hell yeah. Pidgey! Come on, Pidgey. Where you at, fam? Getting burned? I'm making, I'm making chicken. 
Yep, it's a Peebus reference for sure. He wanted to shove his Peebus right into the trainer's bub hole. And more fried chicken. Anyone hungry? Oatmeal serving up fried chicken right now. I'll tell you what. Hey, look, Rock Smash. Uh, I think Flakes can learn Rock Smash, actually. So, do you how do? You never not think correctly because pickles. Give me that. Ooh, a shell bell. That makes me super honey. I needed the shell bell. It's a shell of a time to have a shell bell. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and give the shell bell to Cap Crunch. Mice Krispies. That sounds cute as fuck. Alright, dear dude. dude. Alright, what are we getting? Oh! We got a Zubat. The one Pokemon I didn't want. Charmander's gonna be a flying type. I don't want to have two flying types. But here we are. Huh? So I thought, shut up, fat boy. Yeah, I am. Dupes claws? Yes, not the dupes. I haven't caught a Zubat yet. Eddie, the one on the stream. Unlike you. Can't talk to me unless you're on stream. Count Chocula, yeah, Count Chocula is the, probably the best name for this. <laughs> Cheery Owl! Cheerio Owl, basically. Alright, that should be, oh fuck, now I gotta get another... Another hypnosis off. So let's go ahead and get another tackle. Fuck you with your hip, with your supersonics. I hope there's enough letters for that on the game. Count Chocula. I will eat your cereal. At least we caught it. Count Chaco. It looks like it's gonna have to be. I'm just gonna put Chocula. Chocula. People will understand. Just imagine a mono flying Nuzlocke in this game, all named after cereal. What could possibly go wrong? Alright, so we got Chocula. I guess, uh. Man, we ain't got a choice. We gotta start training other Pokemon. We're about to get over leveled here.
I mean, I could run around in circles until Togepi evolves. I mean, hatches, but then it's another flying time. It'd be Crobat, Hoot Hoot, Pidgey, Zard, Crobat, Hoot Hoot, Pizzy, Zard, Togetic, and Skarmory. Or Gliscor, Gligar, Gliscor, whatever, whatever pops out first. Oh, you hear that water? Anyone got a pee yet? Ah. Ah, ah. All right, time to raise this zoo bat like it's one of our own because it is. I like Crobat. Don't get me wrong, people. I love Crobat. I drafted Crobat and I draft Golbat in draft leagues all the time. But I don't want to use a zoo bat in my playthrough. It would still suck. You definitely damn right. All right, so Captain Crunch is basically gonna be run house in here. I don't know why Onyx. Uh... <laughs> I don't know why Onyx hardened against the zoo, but maybe seeing a flying type of friend was like, oh, that makes me horny, and because he was ready to rock slide my my ass to death. Christian the Great, welcome to the stream, man. Where's Will? I know y'all two normally watch stuff together. KO whole team. <laughs> for real. Thunder would be a mess for that team. And there's no point in using the repel right now, because our team is a little lackluster. If there's light, a cave isn't scary. If you're strong... Pokemon aren't scary. What kind of fucking logic is that? Hey, look, we got Guy Fieri on the other side. He's gonna take us to Flavor Town. <laughs> Those two do everything together. Probably his homework. Well, tell him to stop doing homework and watch Pokemon. Oh shit, I switched to the wrong Pokemon. Yikes. Alright, it's okay. I don't know if that's a Flashfire Vulpix, so I'm just gonna scratch it to death. Damn, Eddie, talking shit already. You're gonna scare Christian away. Oh, Captain Crunch is level 16. Oh, did it roar? Maybe I didn't. I don't know. I guess I'm not paying enough attention. Dumby? Alright. I don't know what Dumby is. I know what Gumby is. It's one of my favorite shows when I was a child. I scared him off. <laughs> Probably. Chocula! Come back! Coco Puff is going mad! Oh, defense! See, all these rock types like to raise their defense. Uh, yeah, sadly, we do have one death. Uh, we had Ghastly die to a unknown with a hidden power ghost or psychic. I don't know which one it was using, but it was super effective, and it made me want to cry. How can you forget that? That's like the worst death possible, Eddie. Bruh, look at me. I'm the captain now. That was hella garbage for sure. I was like, oh, you know what? E easy EXP for my boy Ghastly here. And then... <laughs> uh, unknown A said, nah, I got you, fam. Blue! Alright, so now we're gonna go to Captain Crunch. It's okay, Eddie. I wanted to forget it. So I drink. Um, 
But, uh, Geodude's gonna go down here. Cocula is a, not evolving, is gaining levels like it should. Booberry died. Dude, that was that was a perfect nickname for that thing. It's a big ass blueberry. Cause blueberries are purple for some reason. See another rock type getting hard when he sees a flying type. It's like the game knows like rock types love getting horny over flying types dying to rock type moves. Oh, another Geodude down. Another one bites the dust. Ow! You should watch an anime called Attack on Titan Steven Watch. Is there punctuation supposed to be in there? Or I'm guessing it's a Attack on Titan. Steven watches it. Or is it called Attack on Titan Steven Watch? I don't know. I don't know names of animes. AOT, so I guess it is just Attack on Titan. Got it. Look, another poke a rock type Pokemon getting Defense scrolled up versus the thing. I'm telling you, man, rock types love killing fight flying types so much it makes them hard. Here we go. Too bad, Super Sun. It keeps confusing my Pokemon. I'm seriously upset. Oh shit, I got a Zubat. He's mad at me. He's gonna kick my ass now. Guy Fieri part two. Why does a fire type user have a coughing? That shit makes no sense. Actually, down to three now. It's okay. It's okay, Eddie. People will come and go. But as long as people enjoyed it, that's all that matters. And Captain Crunch is going to take a bite out of crime. Oh, flinch. Beautiful. I'll take it. I'll give it a shot, maybe. Depending. I have a lot of recommendations that people want me to watch, so we'll see. We'll see how that goes. I'm only one man. I can only watch so much anime. Currently, I think the only anime I've actually watched all the way through so far is Seven Deadly Sins, and even that's coming out with another season in the summer. The final season makes me sad. It's okay to feel sad. Coughing, bite. Whoa, what's this? Oh, shell bell! Woohoo! We needed that. Uh, I've watched Seven Deadly Sins in English. It, it actually has more than... It's not in Jap it's in Japanese right now, but I'm gonna wait for the dub to come out. I don't I don't like reading while I'm trying to watch something. Because then I'll miss something. And it's just like eh. AOT, the time I got reincarnated as a slime, demon slayer, Dragon Ball Z, and the rise of Shield Hero. 
and that is the final season for Attack on Titan. Are all great. <clears throat> I don't know, Eddie. My brother said uh, Shield Hero is whack. That's what that's what I said, and you're like that one's not that great. Oh, never mind. He said Shield Hero is awesome. Slime is not good. I don't know. I've never watched any of them. I'm too important to watch all those animes right now. I don't know. I just never got into uh, Dragon Ball Z. I've watched it multiple times. I've tried. I've given it a chance. I just can't do it. Dang, Steven, you better come in this chat and defend yourself. He says, screw you. I'll give them all a shot. Christian said slime is pretty good. Oh, I've watched most of Sailor Moon. I still haven't finished it, though, because it's repetition like a motherfucker. Beginning of the episode. Here's the lesson. Middle of the episode. Fight the monster. Oh, I'm too scared. I need to face the lesson, and I don't want to. End of episode. I've learned my lesson, and I'm better for it. And then, that's it. And then, every episode is the same way. It's like they picked, um, I don't know. They pick the plot points, replay it every time, and then it's like, okay, and then that. I've watched most of them, like I said. I've never, I haven't watched all of them. I used to watch Sailor Moon as a kid. Season 5, the last, is only in subbed. Oh, then I probably won't finish it. <laughs> oh, now we find a sand true. Fuck off. I would have loved a sand true. Well, way to ruin it, Eddie. But damn, that's fucking morbid as shit. Why would they have that as the ending? I mean, it makes sense, but morbid. I haven't watched any Demon Slayer, so it's not like I haven't given it a shot. I just haven't had time to watch it. Huh? They are. I got all this stuff to do for the stream that I do all day. You think layouts make themselves? Yeah, while I was doing this. Again, I'm not talking to you unless you're on stream. No one knows what you're talking about. It's not, but it's a huge plot point. Okay, so it's not a spoiler. Got it. I came through the cave, but I still have plenty of energy left. I don't give a damn. I think I care. Hiker Anthony? Who the fuck's name is Anthony? The dumb name. Not even, it doesn't even sound real. All right, so we got Chocula needing to get a level, and Captain Crunch needing to get a level. And again, the Geo Dude gets the fence curled hard when it sees a flying type. I'm telling you guys, rock types love it when they see a flying type. They get super honor. They yod. Chocula grew to level 9 and learned Astonish. It's astonishing me how bad that Pokemon is. Alright, so High Grant thing's gonna send him a chop out. Demon Slayer came out with a movie that are ready. 
Okay, that's not me, is it? Demon Slayer came out with the movie that already came out. And they are coming out with season two very soon in 2021. Okay, so it's only one season so far. Don't sound too bad. Dang, you saw where that spark came from? He said, Doing! Leer. Alright, time to water gun. We're in the rain. Boosted by the game. Ah. Damn, he went Super Saiyan on us. He went the Super Saiyan that stays yellow. All right, Camp Crunch, get some level up. Finally level 17. Sadly, it's 18 when it evolves, so... There's that. And then we have Zubet over here, trying to gain some level as well. <clears throat> as well. All right, Demon Slayer is on Netflix. Okay, cool. Who are you? You don't know us. We are Team Rocket. What? We broke up a while ago. Give me a break. We have not broken up. Actually, we did once. Oh, so you're a liar? But we have come back to pursue Giovanni's ambitions. Enough talk. Shut up and just beat it. Good. Aw, oh, shit, boy. So, he's not a good guy. He just pushed that old man. Steven, Christian said, watch my stream. Uh, would you like to rest your Pokemon? Of course, they're tired. We just went through a whole cave. By the way, is Professor... Uh, Professor? Is Officer Jenny around? I want to make a claim about... Uh, a... <laughs> About a dispute between an old man and a Team Rocket member. Alright guys, we made it. And you know what we're here for. Red pills! Red pills! Red pills! Oh shit. Okay. I'll buy four for now. Alright. I think I can go to the forest without... Fighting my in my uh, rival, but just in case, I'm not ready for that fight. So I'm gonna save, see if I can actually go to the forest or not. And if he pops up, I'm resetting the game. Okay, good, because I need this encounter. I, I need a grass type. And Mary Jane might be on our team for the third time in a row. Look, it's Mary Jane! Getting something sweet tonight? Oh shit, what does that mean? Sorry, Eddie. I can't I can't nickname Oddish anything but Mary Jane. It's the weed Pokemon. See with all this cereal around, you need Mary Jane. Because without Mary Jane, who's going to consume all the cereal? No, it has to be Mary Jane. Has to be. Has to be Mary Jane. Someone's got to eat the cereal. And it's the Mary Jane user. And you know it. You know, whenever the person around... When your when your friendly neighborhood, uh, what's it called? When your friendly neighborhood Toker is around, and he gets really high or she, whatever, they're always like, God damn, I could go for a bowl of cereal right now. And you're like, Damn, you right. Cereal sounds good. Ooh! So, Mary Jane is what it is. You can't nickname Oddish anything else.
Mary Jane in the house. House! I don't care if it's a, it's a male Pokemon. It's Mary Jane. Gotta get that Mary Jane up in the house, y'all. Alright, so now we got a new Pokemon to add to the team. Add to the squad. Add it to the squad. Alright, so deposit. Deposit, hoot hoot. And deposit, whooper. And we're gonna withdraw. We're not going through withdrawals because weed is an addictive, of course. But we're gonna withdraw it to our party. Just kidding, guys. Anything's addictive. <clears throat> but people who smoke weed are always like, weed is not an addictive substance, man. It is just something to take yet, chalk, man. And then you tell them, all right, go a week without smoking. Nah, man, it's how I, it's how I cope with life, man. And you're like, yeah, you're addicted. So, don't let them lie to you. Anything can be addictive. So, now you just got to come talk to this old man. And he's going to be like, I need to go show that, that kid what's up, you know? He's stepping in my hood, trying to steal my well. And we're just like, bro, it's not that serious. Calm down. And now the guy's gone. We're like, shit, now we got to go in the well, too. Slow bro. Or slow poke. Oh, look, here's the old man now. Hey there, Joe. The guard up top took off when I shouted at him. But then I took a tumble down the well. And now I need a medical marijuana card. Uh, I slammed down hard on my back, so I can't move. Rats. If I were fit, my Pokemon would have punished him. Ah, it can't be helped. Dude, you could use your Pokemon and be immobilized. I mean, it's not like they... They need you to move to fucking fight. Sounds like a crock of horseshit to me. But, whatever. And we get our first encounter. Not too close. We already have a zoo bat. <laughs> I was standing guard up top when some old coot yelled at me. He startled me so much that I fell down here. How about I vent my anger and take it out on you? That's not very healthy, dude. You should go see a therapist. You are challenged by Team Rocket Grunt. Oh, he's got a Rattata. Okay, well, that's not going to do much. So let's go ahead and go out to Oatmeal. Oatmeal! Alright, he goes Focus Energy. And now Quick Attack. Ember to the face, and it lives. How the fuck? Either way, it goes down finally. Both get 54 EXP, and he goes to Tata again. We'll go ahead and switch back out Chocula. Yeah, it's just Slowpoke and Zubat. So we're going to be forced to catch a Slowpoke. There we go. That's what you need to do, Oatmeal. One hit KOs. It's gone. 
Ooh, super potion. You know what that reminds me of? Super lotion. Stop taking slowpoke tails. What? You want us to just obey a direct order from Executive Proton? Did you lose an electron? Um, if you want us to stop, if you want to stop us, you'll have to defeat us all. Go ahead and try. You know, I hear that man could be real positive, but what he's doing right now is very negative. Talk to La. Go ahead and astonish this fool. Astonish him with your power and might. Chocula, you need to be faster, bro. What's your, what's your problem? You're getting outsped. Damn, and he got a crit. That's not cool. Two crits. What the fuck? Uh? There we go. Get us a crit of our own. Now that's a level up right there. I'll tell you what. Alright, we'll keep battling. We're gonna just have to heal here, though. Oh shit, that was a bad idea. You know what, let's just switch out. Oatmeal! The most important meal of the day. He's serving it up Gary's way. Oh, that shit is bullshit right there. Well, we'll go ahead and ember it. Ooh, it wants to wrap. It wants to give us a hug. All right, ember again. You know damn well. Damn, Eddie, it feels like he came here to promote Demon Slayer and then dipped. He was like, watch this series. It's an amazing show. And then, gone. Not to watch the stream any longer. Alright, Chocula is up. Got caramel and peanut butter M&M's and ice cream sandwiches. Fuck! Sounds good. I wish I could eat sweets like that. I can't eat, I can't eat sugary snacks like that anymore. <clears throat> Close as I get to is hard candy. I can't do like ice cream and all that too much. If anything, actual ice cream, but not like, oh, Eminem chunky old ice cream bars. I can't do that no more. Too sweet. Feel like make me feel like I'm diabetic or something and I'm not talk you love come out and save the day oh shit super saiyan Rattata. die to my ember please don't You don't just get busy after promoting a show, Eddie. I'm telling you, man. It's all set up, man. <laughs> I shouldn't. I'm fat, but I'm alone without a wife to tell me otherwise. Hey, it be like that sometimes. I'm astonished you're not doing more, Chocula. Bro, this is why Zubat is trash. Look how little he's doing. <clears throat> Ain't getting flinches or nothing. Pathetic. Oh, and now it's confused. Oh, that's kind of romantic, Eddie. 
Oh, and I hit myself. Should I risk it? Let's do it. Hit. Hit. There we go. I believed in you, Chocula, and you did it. Ooh, you almost gained a level. Alright, switch Pokemon. We're gonna go to Mary Jane here. Get her some levels, too. Oh, critical hit, go fuck yourself. Oatmeal, you need to get your special attack game up, son. Yeah, it was Gen 7 when it was buffed. It needed to be buffed, like, Gen 1. That shit was trash. 20 damage. Time for the real battle. Ooh, exactly 20 points. That's cute. Alright, go ahead and get oatmeal up in hell. And let's get ready to fight the most positive person on Team Rocket, Proton. What do you, we have here? I'm often labeled as the scariest and cruelest guy in Team Rocket. I thought it was the most positive, sincere guy. I strongly urge you not to interfere with our business. <laughs> Look at that clown. You were challenged by Executive Proton. He sent out the shittiest Pokemon in the game. But so did you! Alright. We're gonna go ahead and get an Astonish out here. I did nothing. And now we're fucking confused. You would have thought, right? But no. They're just like, and eh, leech life can stay sucking. Alright. Zubat used leech life. I'm gonna supersonic. Hopefully, I don't hurt myself in confusion. And there we fucking go. Hurt yourself. Oh, yeah. I love it when that happens. Chocula broke confusion. We're gonna try to get this kill with Chocula. Hurt yourself again. No! Why? Alright, we're going to have to go ahead and go for it again. Supersonic. Oh yeah! Leech life. Oh, yeah. Chocula grew to level 11. All on his lonesome. Alright, Mary Jane. Come in to get some EXP. He better not explode. I swear to God. It doesn't matter where we go. There's always someone who doesn't agree with us. <laughs> Oatmeal is here, baby. I swear to God, if you explode, I'm throwing my controller across the screen. Ember attack. Of course, we're poisoned. 
<sighs> this game hates us. Ember attack. There we go. Smog again. Alright, all we gotta do is land one more hit. And this coffin goes down. Are you serious? Did you come here thinking you could mess up our plan? Yep. Ember. Man, my boy Oatmeal got the spectacles on. He said, fuck your smoke screen. I see everything. Oh, you damn right you're gonna learn Dragon Rage. The fuck you mean? Get rid of Growl. Learn Dragon Rage. Mage Jangru to level 8. Oh, hell yeah! <clears throat> oh, fuck yeah, guys. Here we go. The moment we've all been waiting for. Star Million! Yeah, that was the only positive thing about that. But boy, if that ain't the sexiest fucking middle stage evolution you've ever seen. Team Rocket was... Ended broken up three years ago, but we continued our activities underground. A small obstacle like you won't be much of a problem for our mission. I advise you to be very afraid of what is to come. I don't want to know what is to come. I just want you to leave the slowpoke well. Bigger oatmeal. We, we upgraded to the, the extra large... My back's better, too. How convenient for you, Kurt. Get the fuck out of my face and make me some Pokeballs, you bastard-ass bitch. How convenient. He's like, oh, my back hurts. I can't fucking uh, fight my Pokeball. Yeah. But the second we're done, oh, my back feels much better. Thank you for uh, doing all the work for me. Take this black Pokeball and figure out what it does. Yeah, give me your grandpa's number, I guess. So tomorrow at 10.06 when we're streaming again, we'll have to come back and figure out what Pokeball that is. Tonight, we're gonna be two badges in. Cause I'm about to fight the leader. Well, in a minute. Alright, so basically I'm gonna I'm gonna start leveling up uh what do you call it? Mary Jane Right, what a fat bastard. He could at least help with like two or three of those battles. Alright, so now we're going to purposely battle everyone in the gym, because I always like to do that. EXP is EXP, baby. Ooh, I love the way the heavy ball looks. Too bad it doesn't really work. <laughs> Mary Jane said, fuck your Caterpie. But oatmeal's coming in. Alright, time to Ember attack. I should have just Dragon Raid, right? I mean, Ember's super effective. It should take it down with one hit, but, you know. Some of these mods' HP is pretty high. Maybe. Mary Jane, come back in so you can get some EXP, girl. Well, guys, how's everyone's night going? I need y'all to talk to me, man. How's it going, brothers and sisters out there watching the Pokemon stream? Are you enjoying? Is there some topics I could talk about that would make it more pleasurable? I'm here to serve, man. I'm in the entertainment business right now. Um, oh shit, I'm poisoned too. Well, I guess I need to go buy some antidotes. <clears throat> but... 
while I have a lot of people here, I would like to remind y'all that in 19 days, we'll be having the draft posted here for PML. Live draft, people will be picking their mons for their team May 15th at noon Central Time. And I'm gonna go heal and buy some antidotes because I know Eddie, you're talking to me, but everyone else is just like, oh my god, is he gonna say hi to me if I say hi? Like, yes, I'll say hi. So I'm here for. Eddie's the reason I'm not talking to myself right now. <laughs> Watch my past streams. It happens. Um, let's see here. Oh, uh, what am I doing? No. I got I got the members I want. Oh, you know what sucks though? If I train up Mary Jane and Zubat, I have two poison types. Serva the nuts. Serva the nuts. Alright, I'm gonna get four just to be safe. <clears throat> I don't even know what that means, Eddie, but I love it. Uh give me two more of those. So that means I need to get a dark type for sure for my last Pokemon because we can't we can't just have two poison types and no answer for it. Alright, so it's this one I think. So, mm, yeah, boy. Alright, so Oddish looks cute as fuck walking behind me. So that we can agree on. Fuck, it's a Weedle. You know what, I'm gonna stay in. I'm gonna go acid on this thing. You know, you can't get Sneasel to like... The very end of the game, which is stupid as hell. But I'm saying it with Mary Jane because I can't get poisoned. And it's neutral damage because I'm also a poison type. You know what? I'm gonna try to get Snubble because Granville used to be a dark type in this game. And I've never used a Grand Bull in the game. They did Grand Bull dirty, dude. They should have. They should have left them dark. They should have. They should have. Uh, I don't know why they made him fully fucking fairy type. That pissed me off. It's like why he was a dark type and then you made him the type that's super effective to dark that makes no sense what they should have done was they should have left it normal and dark but they should have went normal fairy and then dark fairy and then that would have made like one of the typings we don't have yet they could have got that out of the way in gen 7 granville used to be dark i believe all right look it up let me know I could have swore it was dark type. Could have swore it was dark type. <clears throat> it has to be somewhere. Sorry, I, I, I'll keep spamming the button.
All right, we'll find out. I mean, we're going to find out. It was normal starting Gen 2 till Gen 6. Oh. Dude, I could have swore it was Dark type. Oh, that's not good. Oh, I guess, I mean, facts are facts. But I could have swore. I don't know. I thought it was Dark type. My mistake. I mean, it makes sense. It looks dark. It's all good, Christian. I was just messing with you, man. How you doing, brother? And by the way, guys, if y'all want to use some cool-ass emojis like the ones I just put in the chat, go ahead and subscribe. House me out and get y'all some cool shit. I know Will likes to use the hype one a lot. Slime has two seasons, gotcha. Yeah, two seasons, but how many fucking episodes? <clears throat> it's like, yeah, two seasons with... 376 episodes in each one. I knew Ursaring was normal type, but that's because I, I really liked that Pokemon. I, I, I honestly never used it, but I liked it, so I knew about it. 25 and 17. Okay, that's not too bad. And then, um, you know, you know what Pokemon I thought was dark type for the longest, but it wasn't? No. I used to think, uh, Glalie was ice dark, and it's just ice. And I was like, since when is it just ice? Uh, ever since it, it was, it, it, uh, ever since it's existed, it's been a uh, ice type only. Oh shit. Woo! There you go, Eddie. That's the use of those Z-Bucks right there. That's cool, Christian. <clears throat> Keep on grinding out them slime episodes. Um, I think you can even use uh you can even use some Z-Bucks to use the, uh, the hype emoji with the Charizard. Oh yeah! Spinner goes down. Fuck off, Ladybug. Damn, Mary Jane has grown some levels. I'm not even paying attention. Obviously. But right, Eddie? I thought, I thought that thing was ice dark. For the longest time. It has that evil vibe about it. Like, how, what else, but what other typing do you think it would be? Gang, gang! There you go! Hype it up! Sadly, you can only use one at a time, but you can still use it!
All right, so it's gym battle time, guys. Get ready. Get ready for this. Christian, get a hold of uh, get a hold of Will. Tell him to watch the stream for the gym battle. He's better at clipping videos than I am. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry. All right. No more Mr. Fuck around. Oh shit, you used two. Look at that. Yeah, I thought... I mean, I thought Sudoodle was grass for a little while, but I watched the anime pretty regularly. So, because of Brock, I knew it wasn't. So I was like, oh, okay. Well, that's nice to know. Well, actually, I'm lying. I never thought of that. I never thought that. Because uh, <laughs> in the game, I, I'd use Sudoodle all the time. So that, I lied. There I go, making up a memory. Um, but yeah, I thought Sudowoodo was a, oh yeah, I just read that. All right, guys, here we go. It is time for the gym challenge. Hi, Bugsy. I never lose when it comes to bug type Pokemon. My research is going to make my, make me the authority on bug type Pokemon. Let me demonstrate that I've learned from my studies. And Bugsy's a boy, for most people who don't know. Looks like a girl, but it's not. God dang! And funny enough, he's the only Pokemon trainer who leads off with the Scyther. Yep. Bugsy's a boy. I liked it because it was like, oh, it's the one Pokemon that blocked my way. It's pretty good in game, but it's not good out. It's not good anywhere else. I mean, there was a guy in PML named Michael. He used to make pretty good use of Sudowoodo. I ain't even gonna lie. He used to fucking wreck with it. Uh, not wreck, but you know, he would do good things with it. He gets a good move set. All right, Mary Jane, trying to earn your keep. Time, trying, time, little, little, time to earn your keep. Yeah, I figured Bugsy was a boy because I was like, what girl likes bugs? But then it was confirmed and I was like, okay, it makes sense. It's a boy. Gang, gang, Mary Jane taking on a gym leader. All right, let's see if Cap Crunch can get to level 18 after this one. I really want to evolve it. I doubt it will, because it's facing a Kakuna. But, let's fucking do this thing. Water gun! Ooh! Water gun! Get me that shell belt, baby! That's it? Okay. Yo, Eddie, this is the first generation where you don't faint from poison outside of battle, right? Oh, fuck off, dude. I'm gonna use a super potion on a worthless fucking Pokemon. That could at least give him Butterfree and Beedrill. That would have made this decently hard. 
No pun intended on the hardened jokes. Forever poisoned. I don't want to be forever poisoned. I don't want to be poisoned forever. 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 Yeah, there we go, bitch. Bruh, that's one HP. No, I hope so. Whoa! The game glitched out. It was like, you're too good. My research isn't complete yet. Okay, you win. Take this badge. Joe, receive the hive badge. Woo! Look at that ladybug badge pop on screen. Do you know the benefits of the hive badge? You, why didn't they give it, like, the honeycomb badge or something? Like, if it's a hive badge. Or they could have made the badge look like a beehive. They, they just made it a ladybug. They could have just called it the bug badge. Stupid developers. If you have it, Pokemon up to level 30 will obey you, even traded ones. Pokemon that no cut will be able to use it outside of battle too. Here, I want you to have this. Obtain TM89. Yeah, that's your turn. You can swap out a battle while you're battling. Oh, that's cool. Oh shit. I pushed the wrong button. Yeah, let's do this. That was distracting me. In gold and silver, you sent out Scyther last? Are you sure? Maybe you did. It's not like I have... It's not like I haven't been wrong for the last... Shit. I think I clipped the gym badge. I guess not. Oh, well. First stream and we're already two battle two ugh, two battles two badges down. I don't know if we battled the third gym yet. No, I didn't get another death. I just put some Pokemon in the PC. So far, I just got the one. Oh, but yeah, guys. Let me go ahead and remind everyone watching. Uh, I am going to do a giveaway at 100 followers. So if y'all can invite people to the stream and get them to follow and we get to 100 followers, I'll be doing a giveaway in, on Facebook. You can do exclamation point Facebook and you'll get the link to my Facebook page. That's where I post links whenever I stream. And uh, yeah, guys. Sheesh, there's Chicken Will. So the more people y'all get to join, the better chance y'all get of winning a giveaway of Pokemon plushies. They will be predetermined plushies but i guess the first person will get to choose first out of the three and then so on and so forth until all three are gone but let's go ahead and do this here dang it william i need you to clip that last battle <laughs> all right battle time baby Hey, look, it's Will. Tell me something. Is it true that Team Rocket has returned? What? You beat them? Ha! <laughs> Quit lying. Are you serious? Then let's see how good you are. <clears throat> Your rival, Chicken Will, would like to battle. Will sent out Ghastly. All right, Chicken Will, what you got for me? Yeah, Will, you weren't here whenever I started the game, so I decided to make you my rival. Come 
<laughs> well, I lose. Nothing new. Well, gas is going down here. It decided to kill itself. Suicide prevention, kids. Alright, so we take the curse damage here, but we're clearly going to switch out because we don't want to die to it. So Chocula comes out and Oatmeal comes in. Now let's get this Ember going. Damn, Bayleaf is a fat bitch. And for some reason it went reflect instead of light screen. Maybe it doesn't have light screen. And of course. So I'm just going to go for Dragon Rage. Hopefully that does enough damage. And it does. Bayleaf goes down. Whew. He always loses. That's fucked up. Alright, Zubat's coming in. Let's go ahead and get Cap Crunch. It's Cap and Crunch. Look at this. It's Cap and Crunch. He's gonna bite the zoo bat. It's dead now. Oh shit, it did nothing. Holy fuck. That zoo bat bulky? It must be bold nature. Oh yeah, it's it's defensive nature. Why is the shell go only giving me one HP back after doing a shit ton of damage? It's true. I'm sure Will doesn't care about Pokemon anyway. I mean, he probably likes Pokemon, but eh, I don't think the games attract his attention. Oh no, I'm hurting myself in confusion. Snapped out. Just in time, Captain French. I believed in you. Okay, well, that just means you need a you need to um set a challenge for yourself in the game, and it'll get you it'll get you that feeling of want even more. But we defeat Will in game here, and uh, no deaths. So thankfully, we get to move on with no repercussion. Oh. And we are healing, and we are healing, and we are healing our minds. Alright, time to see this real quick. Alright. So, Milk Tank. Whitney's strongest Pokemon is level 20, or 19, sorry. I'm not going to get mad at myself if I get to level 20. Just saying. Just saying that right now. Because, uh, fuck Milk Tank. And it's rolled out. I hope we can catch a, a Drowsy. Alright, time to use repels here. Follow me and you'll see a world of... What the fuck do you want? Alright, Farfetch's are here. And we gotta get their attention somehow. Oh, look! I stepped on a branch. And Farfetch is like, who the fuck is that? Alright. So the first time I played this, I had no idea how the fuck to get our... Oh, shit. Oh, look at this! We did it. We did it. We hatched an egg. Togepi hatched from the egg. No one cares. Look at that little piece of fucking garbage. Alright, what do we name this? It's, uh, we gotta nickname it a cereal brand. <laughs> name it Christian? 
<laughs> oh. oh, damn, because he's garbage. All right, well, William has spoken. What's an extreme randomizer? I've watched them. I wouldn't know how to explain it, though. Professor Elm, how the fuck did you know? I the egg hatch. The randomizer is taken to the extreme. <laughs> well, I guess from what I hear is Moves are randomized, IVs are randomized, abilities are randomized, route Pokemon are randomized. Pretty much everything possible is randomized. Even evolutions. So you can have a Magikarp evolve into a Rayquaza and then later evolve into a Maractus. That is what an extreme randomizer is. I think. Yeah, run, bitch. You know what else is hard? My dick! Is that what you're gonna say, Will? Yeah, he inserted smirk face, so he was gonna be dirty. Pokemon are defense type and the moves are hard. Whatever that means. Some are not like that. Okay. Ah, oh, my far and fetched! Bruh. He named one far fetch far and one far fetch fetch. You found them for us, kid. Without them, we wouldn't be able to cut trees for charcoal. Thanks, kid. Now. Can I thank you? I know. Here's this. HMO1 for cut. Alright, we gotta go back and get a charcoal from that guy later. And HM cut. I'm not putting it on any of those mods. Fuck that. Move. Can we get to the door without running into a Pokemon, please? Fuck! So close, yet so far away. Alright. We're almost there. On our way to Viridian City. Something, 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 Viridian City. Alright, might as well heal our Pokemon, right? Why not? Alright, now we're gonna drop Togepi, our uh, Christian, our Togepi in the PC because we're not using that trash. And then we're going to withdraw Centric because he's gonna be our HM slave. Butt face. Butt face the HM slave. Alright, cut. Yes. Butt face learn cut. Alright, what else can butt face learn? Rock smash? No, it can't. Interesting. Zigzagoon can learn it. Trash ass Pokemon. But welcome, welcome all. I'd like to remind you again. Uh, join Zamora Gaming on Facebook because once we get to a hundred followers, we will be doing a giveaway. Top three people to enter the giveaway will be grant will be gifted a Pokemon plush. It would be pre-selected, but. 
first who gets to choose first, and then so on and so forth. Shit! I should have went to go get the charcoal already. And then, uh, if you haven't followed yet, go ahead and follow. That'll help us get to our goal. Waste of a repel. What the fuck, dude? <clears throat> Thanks for saving my ass bike there. Here's a piece of charcoal. And you know who the fuck's gonna get that charcoal? I should do an extreme randomizer? Maybe. I might do an extreme randomizer, depending on, uh... Depending on... Oh, shit. Everyone's charcoal now. It just depends on what kind of viewership I get on my videos. If I'm not getting a lot, I'm not going to put that much effort into getting all that set up for an extreme extreme randomizer. Because, uh, I mean, I could do it myself on Gen 3 and do a Fire Red or Emerald or something like that. But if I... But it's a lot of work to put into doing it on like a 3DS game, which I would much prefer to do a randomized nose lock on. So it just depends. Like this through the region stuff, I've been getting pretty good views. So as long as I can keep it up and hopefully positively get better, that'd be even better. Um, because like tonight we got six viewers watching pretty regularly, and I'm enjoying that. So, keep up the good work, you guys, and I'll keep up my end of the bargain. Uh, let's just go ahead and repel. I know, right? You put a Charmander in the game, and it's like, what the fuck you doing? Blur, blur, blur. Bling, 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 bling. Wait a minute. I could wait too if you want. Look at that fat ass hitting his head on trees. Holy shit, Chicken Will. I don't know when those became a thing. I don't think I... I didn't make those. Those are badass fucking emojis too. Does everyone have an option to use those those look like token tournament art all right i'm gonna teach everyone headbutt because headbutt is a good move to have <clears throat> Captain Crunch, learn headbutt. Maybe it's from other people you follow, Will? I don't know. I didn't make those. Maybe I just got them from the viewerships or something? I don't know. It, it did give me some random ones before I made my own. Oatmeal learned head, but fuck yeah, they're cool. I like the dark Mewtwo one. You never know, Eddie. Go ahead and check them out. Check out which ones you got. Oh, look at that. X attack? How worthless. Alright, repel time. Repel time. Repel time. 
Ooh, an antidote. I only have like eight of those. I like when you're right next to the water, you can hear it. Hiya! Kimono girl, kimono girl, lost and all alone. Poor girl lost in the dark elix forest. That didn't rhyme. The second part didn't rhyme. Get the fuck out of here, stupid. What? You remember me from Violet City? You must be imagining. Anyway, will you show me how to get out of this forest? Yeah, sure. Ask the guy who's tripping on shrooms how to get out of the forest. You will? Aren't you lost in the forest as well? How do you know how to get out of here? Because Charmeleon's a smart boy. Are you showing me how to get out? You're such a smart Pokemon. See you soon. Just walk to the only path you haven't walked through yet, dumb broad. Jesus fucking Christ. Just when you thought people couldn't get any stupider. And they say boys go to Jupiter to get more stupider. <laughs> Am I right? I'm just kidding. I don't know. I don't know things. I just talk. <clears throat> you just came up with one what? Girls go to Venus to get some penis? <laughs> That's funny. I like that one. You, cool, you kids need to make my sayings I made up in, when I was younger cool. Whenever someone tripping, be like, don't hate, masturbate. Just tell them that. Make it cool. And then one day I'll be like, I said that. And people made it cool. That's awesome. I need y'all to carry out my, my, uh, proverbs. When they ask y'all what y'all's favorite speech... Oh, look, Drowsy! Now we can get my chop! Alright, Astonish time. Don't confuse me. Alright, pal, that's fine. Astonish again. Don't confuse me. Don't confuse me. Okay, good. All right, now we're gonna switch. We're gonna go to Cat and Crunch. Don't practice with your R2D2 toy. <laughs> That's fucked up. All right, great ball time. Yeah, we got a drowsy. I just got a drowsy. I just got a drowsy. I just got a drowsy. Wonder where it's from. Alright, I'm gonna go with Choco Dip on this thing. That's cool. Yeah. Oh no! We ran into a trainer battle! This is where I do my training! No, not the buttons! Not the gumdrop buttons! Do you know the Muffin Man? The Muffin Man? The Muffin Man! Who lives on Drury Lane? Well, she's married to the Muffin Man. The Muffin Man? The Muffin Man! And scene. Alright, here we go. Let's go off with the new found headbutt. Oh, and that rat attack is out of here. 
I don't know, Christian. He said something about don't practice with your R2D2 toys, so I don't know. Steven's laughing, so Chicken Woman must have said something hilarious. Oh my god. Alright, so here we go. Uh, dang, he said, really, William? I don't know what it's about. I just know he said something about R2-D2. Whoa! Alright, so Captain Crunch is gonna get to that nice level 18 right there, and I tell you what, you about to see an evolution that you won't fucking believe, I tell you what. Oh my god, here comes Chocula. Shit. You really had to beam that up? Ooh, Sparrow went for Lear. I'm just gonna go back to Captain Crunch right now. Girls go to Venus to get more penis. Well, Christian, if it makes you feel any better, no one has any idea what the hell he's talking about, so. Anyway. Let's go ahead and... Let's go to Oatmeal, why not? All we know is you practice something with R2-D2. We don't know what. Unless Steven spills the beans about what he does with R2-D2. Huh? <laughs> Uh-oh. Captain Crunch is evolving. I was going to use webcam tonight, but I didn't have time to do my makeup, so. Just kidding, I don't use makeup. But I do need to trade this drowsy. Oh no! More Pokemon! Oh, well, we already got our drowsy encounter, so. Steven better not say something. Damn, Chris said he's going to kick your ass. Tentman said, you better not say something. Damn, he said, ain't he supposed to be asleep? He put you to bed, Steven. Christian said, ain't he supposed to be asleep? He said, you passed your bedtime, son. All right, Christian, he said, sorry, daddy. He'll go to sleep right now. <laughs> oh damn grandma trying to hook us up with lyra but we like nah fam there's the bad bitches out there that lyra ain't it i don't know christian he should he, he'll be his bedtime is 11 so you could put him to bed then Trainers are supposed to. Blah, 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 blah. See? This is the only game that puts you in the phone. I already did, Christian. He's busy texting hoes, he said. I doubt it, but. You know. 
it's Steven for you. You know, this is the only game that puts you in the phone and lets you know when you're not right next to the daycare that your egg is ready. It would be so helpful if you were to say something in the chat. But, he's a dickhead. Alright, now I'm gonna trade the drowsy because we need it for the next battle. Let's see if it's still possible in this game. I got Abra at the game for now, it's my best partner. Okay, good for you, bitch. No one cares. Okay, so all of them are useless. I don't care about X special, stupid. I need, I need me a, I need me a machop. Yeah, dumbass, I know that. <clears throat> Hell yeah, I need that Machop right now. Chocolate dip will be sent. Dang, Christian said watch the stream or go to sleep. <laughs> you tell him, I don't know. That's between you and your lover. Dang, Christian is out for blood, Christian says. I mean, Chicken Will says. I don't know, man. I'm getting him a chop. Jose sent over muscle. Do you have a drowsy? Because I need some macho. I give you macho for drowsy. Bruh. No. Alright, physical attacks, five turns. I can make use of that. Very determines type. It enables user to evade all attacks. Oh, that's double team. Alright. Uh, solar beam. Fire blast. Blizzard. Uh, superpower. Oh no, it's focus blast. Thunder. Hyper beam. But we can't afford any of those. So let's get the fuck out of here. Hey, Brad, I'm trying to go to the bottom floor. Alright, um... We have been streaming for a good-ass minute now. Uh, I'm definitely going to take on all these people down here. I I have second I have second thoughts about using Chocula. I don't, you know what? I'm not using Chocula anymore. I'm gonna put it in the PC. I wasted all that EXP on it, but I'm not gonna use Chocula after all. So since it's the HM slave, Chocula is gonna go in the box. Guts boosted. Hell yeah, dude. I'm a chop. You, you're the man. I'm definitely going to try to get the third badge here. Fuck it. I'm confident in my ability to raise Pokemon. Want to see? No. 
Well, you got a side duck. Italian Slice, welcome to the stream. Thank you for bringing some friends along with you. We are here playing some Pokemon. Thank you for following Emo Dark Souls. It's going good. Just having a good time playing some Pokemon. Drinking a little drink, playing a little game. Alright, let's go Mary Jane here. Hello, Emo Dark Souls. How you doing? Yeah, Eddie Italian Slice hooked us up with some viewers. I am happy with that. I appreciate that so much. You don't even know. Today we started our Through the Regions uh, Johto playthrough. This is the third uh, this is the third installment of Through the Regions. We'll be playing through all eight generations. And so far, so good. We've only had one death, and that was some BS on the part of... Who do you call? I lost Ghastly to uh, What do you call? Dang it! Eddie, who was it again that I lost it to? An unknown. There we go. That's why I couldn't think of the name. It's unknown. Booberry died. Yeah, we have a slight theme going. I kind of broke it because I nicknamed Mary Jane something else. We should both turn our Pokemon some more and have another battle. Exchange numbers? Why not? I love strangers' numbers. I'm gonna edit something real quick. Eh, not that big. There we go. That's good. There we go. Thank you for the follow. And um, if you're a follower with me, don't forget to join Zamora Gaming on Facebook because we will be doing a giveaway once we reach 100 followers. So the more followers, the better. I will be giving away some Pokemon plushies. Three predetermined plushies, but first place gets to choose first all the way to third. And everyone, I'm sure, will enjoy the plushies as well. All right, so we got Groundless in here, so we're gonna go Captain Crunch. It's the taste you can see. Or is that a different one? Satan's Panties, welcome to the raid. Satan's Panties is hotter than the Devil's Crotch and actual thing like is it actually hot down there water gun to growl it oh shit we just we're fighting a cop and we use water gun we're gonna get shot <laughs> Saint Fanny's funny great name damn right that's hilarious Mother, I ain't got time to answer the phone. Sorry. Too busy doing gang shit right now. Alright, what do you got? Eh, thank you, thank you. He he he. Oh, he he he. Thank you, thank you. I thought she was like, eh. Or he was like, eh, thank you, thank you. You know, just another day in the office. Dang, Muscle said he wants to stay at the YMCA. Saw him throw his hands up. Maybe he's a Miley Cyrus fan. Get your hands up, play my song, better fly, fly away. I don't know, but I get that EXP all day, you know what I mean?
You got that right Italian slice? This is the SSG family. Don't forget to check out SSG on Sundays when they do their podcast. All right, let's go ahead and get another karate chop on Diglett. And just so everyone who's raiding knows, if y'all are enjoying, uh, I stream pretty much every day except Sunday. <laughs> so, there's that news. And it's always from like, I always start around 7 or 8, sometimes 9. I try not to start too late, but always from like 7 to like 11, sometimes 12. Oh shit, I meant to push. Give up on Foresight. You're a fighting type. The YMCA is fun to stay at, the YMCA. You damn right. Something, 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 something. You have fun with all the boys. I know. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Some of those lyrics are sus from what I hear. But, you know, it's a good song. It's fun to stay at the YMCA. Uh-oh, we got a future fairy type. Oh, we got paralyzed. But guess what, fellas? We're guts ability. That means our attack is double. I ain't gonna do shit. Wow. So much for guts boosted. Damn, Snubble. Fuck off, dude. You're dropping all my attack stats. It's not cool, man. Well, kinda. What if I am? What are you gonna do about it? You wanna fight about it? All right, so Mareep is coming in. We're going to go ahead and go to Oddish. Now, if I did the motions, I'd pull my headphone jack out of the out of the thing and then have to reset it up. So, no, I, I'm not. <laughs> All right, Mary Jane's attack fell, but it's okay because we're using special attack here, baby. Miss me with that horse shit. Oh, critical hit. Boom, baby. Level 14. That's what I'm talking about. We didn't get to level 21 to evolve. When's the soonest we can get a. Uh, uh, when's the soonest we can get a leaf stone? And just in case you're still here, Italian Slice, I want to say thank you again for the raid. It means so much to me. Oh, Mary Jane is always the MVP. She 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 put the team at ease. She make everyone feel good. She do all the things she's supposed to do. You know what I mean? No. Wrong button. I pushed absorb. I'm supposed to push acid. I need to douse the enemy in acid. Gone. Gone with the wind. Gone with the wind. Yeah. Alright, Bulbasaur, meet your arch enemy. Arch nemesis, I should say. Oh, meal. I wish I had oatmeal puns ready to go. <clears throat> MJ 
has the lesser side effects, but the enemies get acid because we want them tripping balls. Meet me in the mall. It's going down. Everywhere you need to guarantee it's going down. See? We douse them with acid. And everyone on the team tokes it up with the little Mary Jane after the battle. And it gets everyone in higher spirits. You know what I mean? You know Mary Jane's a powerhouse. And she's fucking sweeping people. I don't want your number, but I'll take it, because you kind of kind of cute, you know what I mean? Don't let my mama know! You know, I don't know if they still have it. Um, Back in gold and silver, there's a secret area back here. You surf, and you go all the way down. And then you'll battle these three girls that are like sisters and they're doing some weird shit. I, I forget what the story behind it was. But if you beat them, you get something. I forget what you get. There's nothing great. Uh, but it's, it's something that you would never do, you know? You would never think of doing because it's like, who the fuck is going to surf out there? I don't know if it's here though, in the new game. I've never tried it in the new game. And, um, I think Pokemon, uh, Pokemon Gold and Silver was the first game I actually did, like, research online, because that's when <laughs> it was available to me, because I'm old. And, um, yeah, I learned all the ins and outs I could of Pokemon, uh, Gold and Silver, because I wanted to do all the cheats and stuff. All right, Italian Slice, will you have a good night? Again, thank you for the raid and the support. Uh, but yeah, dude, I, 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 my parents never bought me the, uh, the Game Informer thing for it. Yeah, you can. <clears throat> and, um, yes. So, whenever I had access to that, I was like, might as well. Oh shit, I didn't even mean to push that button. No! It's yes, yes, no, yes, no. I mean, wait, what? I'm losing my mind here. Alright, here we go. Yes. Yes. No. Yes. <clears throat> no. Well, funny enough, Eddie, I would go to work with my dad, and I used his laptop, and he worked for a company that had good internet, so I didn't have, like, I didn't have to deal with the AOL crap, but I did, at home, I had to deal with it, but we didn't have internet at home, we just had a computer, so, you couldn't do online shit at home, all you could do was, like, uh, They'd buy games for the thing. And there's one game I want to find. It was like a bear with a treehouse. And you can do certain things in that game. And I love that game. I just can't remember the name of it. But it was like an actual computer game. I need to look it up. The 90s were a great time. But back to my tangent, there's some shit you can do online. Uh, I mean, in this game that you would have never known unless you had, like, the actual Game Informer thing. Elf Elf Bowling was freaking hilarious. I don't know what that is. Swat. There was this driver game. I forget what it's called. It's not driver. I know there is a game called driver, but it wasn't driver Um, It was a spy game 
that uh, you could you'd run around and you shoot and you'd shoot people out of windows and stuff as a spy and then you'd go down into a subway and then you'd shoot people there and then I, the whole game was shooting people but you know and then there's the furthest I got was the level with the car and you had to go a certain place and you had to shoot people behind you Santa Bold in the pins were elves. <laughs> That's fucked up. Fuck them elves. Now it's the original fuck them kids. Damn, they trash talk Santa? That's the Those elves had balls? But slowly but surely, we are making our way to the third gym leader. I do want to say thank you for everyone who joined with the stream and uh, with the raid, I mean, and stuck with it for so long. Even if Pokemon's not your game, I'm, I hope you enjoyed some of the commentary. Oh, man. I miss the 90s. I miss the 90s stuff that happened. It's just crazy to think everyone from the 90s was in a generation of no phones. Shut up, Will. You're not, you ain't, you weren't even born in the 90s. You didn't even know, you weren't even thought of in the 90s. You were still in your dad's ball sack till like 2005. Come on now. But the 90s was like a magical time because it was a time before phones and then phones weren't until like I was in middle school. Crazy. Crazy thought. <laughs> Me too, man. Told you guys. Centered is trash. <laughs> well played. <laughs> That's like the funnest insult to tell somebody. Sailor Stitch just subscribed. What? Eddie, where'd you find the five bucks at, bro? <laughs> you find it in between the couch cushions. Give it your best shot, or I'll take you down. Welcome to the subscribed members. All right, meow, meow. I hate water, especially wet water. Oh no, Double T! He lived on one HP! There we go, now we can get all the hypes in the chat. Gang gang! I appreciate it, brother. Thank you for the support. It means the world to me. All right, let's go ahead and knock out this other meow. Fuck off, meow, and your scratch attacks. All right, I'm going to heal because I honestly haven't been paying too much attention to this. I've been going crazy with tangents and whatnot. And uh, we need the help. <laughs> oh, yeah, I love this game. And you know what the crazy shit that I learned about this game? I didn't know about the drowsy trade until like two years ago. I was, uh, I was listening to this online thing and they were like, oh yeah, you can, uh, what do you call it? 
they're like, oh yeah, you can actually train a drowsy for a Machop to make the, the gym battle easier. And I, I, I thought to myself, I was like, the fuck you can? Where? Like, I, I was cussing out the podcast I was listening to about Pokemon. And I was like, bruh, I've been playing that game since I was five. How the fuck did I not know that? Right, Christian? It's like, who the fuck thinks of that? I didn't even know it. Alright, Snubble. You get on my goddamn nerves with that intimidate bullshit. Um, it's because you're a first, it's you, you're a first month subscriber. Uh, my, the first month as a affiliate, I guess. I haven't finished that yet. So, uh, you signed up just in time to be part of my first month subscriber, just like Chicken Will. Normally it's on his thing too. Oh wait, never mind. Maybe it's just that it's your first month being a subscriber. Because it's not on wheels anymore. So maybe that's what it is. Yeah, I think that's what it is. It might not be. Who fucking knows? <laughs> I think it's that. <clears throat> I'm still learning Twitch as we go. Welcome, welcome to the stream. If you're new to the stream and you want free Pokemon shit, join my shit on Facebook. Some more gaming. And uh, once we get to 100 followers, we will be doing a giveaway. Oh yeah, probably Chicken Will, because it's it's been a minute. <clears throat> There we go. That's the Facebook group to join. <clears throat> and Eddie, I am nowhere near making money on YouTube yet. You have to have a thousand subscribers, ten, ten thousand watch hours, and some other shit. So <laughs> uh, I'm nowhere near. I'm nowhere near. Oh, fuck off, Jigglypuff. Yeah! That's what I like to see. Oh, Jigglypuff used Pound? Here's a low kick to the face, you broad. It's a cat fight. I just noticed Muscles is a female. Well, you know. She's a guy, so... Oh yeah, people on YouTube make a shitload of money. They get a lot more money from ad revenue. Uh, and they get bonus money from like people who subscribe to their YouTube channel. But you have to be like a badass fucking YouTuber to get subscriptions or a member thing. But here on Twitch, you're solely relying on uh, subscribers. I mean, you get, like, two cents from an ad, but you're mainly getting your revenue from subscribers. Alright, let's headbutt to get the flinch. Yeah, ad, ad revenue is something else on YouTube, man. Ah, oh, fuck off with your disable. Why am I in love with Jigglypuff? Alright, here we go. Jigglypuff is dead. 
Yeah, but I mean, it makes sense because you need so much subscribe. You need so many subscribers and so many views and so much watch time on YouTube. I mean, here it's easier to get like affiliate, I guess, because you only need 50 subscribers and stuff like that. But you can't get partner. I you don't make as much money until you get partner. And partner, you need like 75 average viewers and shit like that. So, I mean, both ways, it takes a while to make money, but eventually I'll make money. And I'm going to go ahead and use the restroom really quick, guys, because I have to pee. So, enjoy looking at the Pokemon screen for a second. Oh, sorry, fellas and females alike. I was holding that for a while. All right. I didn't know. Wear a bikini and do a pool thing like all the chicks are currently doing. <laughs> Fuck that. You don't want to see me in a bikini. That's fucking sure. Unless you're gay. Then, I mean, maybe. But I'm not getting in a bikini. Um, all right. Whew. I feel 12 pounds lighter. Oh, shit. What the fuck? There we go. Woo that was creepy. All right, guys. So we are on our way to Viridian City. Psych. That's far from here. Fuck. You put one code in a game and it wants to fuck up. Alright guys, it's Whitney time. The hottest chick in Gen 2 is about to go down to our muscles. Holy shit balls, guys. We've been streaming for four hours. Four hours? And it's time to face Whitney. Hi, I'm Whitney. You 
I saw you at the radio tower just now. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You want a battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. What a beautiful chocolate man. All right, let's go, let's do it. You are challenged by Leader Whitney. You're dead? I'm alive, my my guy. We about to destroy Whitney. We're gonna give her a pounding like you won't believe. Whoa, don't block me in. Take me to dinner first. Day old. That's a critical hit right there if I tell you what. Muscles is level 19. Wants to learn seismic toss. Might as well get rid of Lear. Hey, I'm a hell of a good voice actor sometimes. Milk tank is out. Will you switch your Pokemon? Nah, fuck that. Let's go. Come at me, fam. Hey, hey! Just one left, but I ain't losing. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. Grab chop. Damn, bitch! Calm down! I swear to God, if you grip me. Alright, super potion time. Alright, Mo Tank, I'm gonna need you not to flinch me 30,000 fucking times. Alright, ready, chop. That did nothing. Alright, here we go. Um. All right, here we go. Butt face, you're foddered. Sorry, you're dying. We are sacrificing butt face for the greater good. Come on, oatmeal, you got this. Dragon rage. Oh, track. Go fuck yourself. You're not in love with that thing. Fuck that cow. Don't fuck that cow. Whichever one makes you feel like you want to attack her. Oh, it lived on one! Poor me! Yeah, fuck you, poor you. Dragon Rage. <clears throat> hit it. No, hit it! Uh-oh. Well, we a little bit fucked. There we go. There we go. You got this, oatmeal. Dragon Rage. That's fine. You're not in love. Hit that bitch. Stupid motherfucker. Alright. Mm. Okay. This isn't good. Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good, this isn't good, this isn't good at all. Alright, here we go. There we go. That's fine. Alright, <clears throat> here we go. Take the stop. Go muscle. Stop. Okay, we can take one. Go low kick. Don't flinch. Fucking hell, stupid! Oh my god. We gotta let muscles fall now. Good job. Way to fucking go.
All right, Dragon Rage. Had to go for a track. No, no, what are you doing? Oh shit, dude, are you serious? Are we gonna lose right now? No. No. No, 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 no. Alright, fuck this. Damn crunch. Sorry, dude. No. Alright, we have a chance. Let's headbutt. We could probably live this next rollout. We can. Headbutt. Oh, that did nothing, dude. Oh, fucking hell. We're gonna lose. He's already at two two rollouts. He has to miss this rollout, right? <sighs> if he doesn't miss this rollout, we definitely lose. Okay, so Captain Crunch is down. All this work to lose to the fucking milk tank. Are you kidding me? And that's the fourth rollout. Bruh. Miss the rollout. Please miss your rollout. He missed! He missed! Dragon Rage for the win! Oh! Charmeleon clutches the battle on 9 HP. Oh! We won! But at what cost? <laughs> Fuck you, Whitney! Fuck you to hell! Oh, man. Why are you crying? You ain't doing a Nuzlocke, you bitch! Uh, fuck me in the tailpipe. Oh. Oh no, you made Whitney cry. Fuck you, she made me cry. Hope she dies in a fire. Well, guys. <laughs> we can just say that was a bittersweet win right there. Fuck me sideways, backwards, forwards, and every other way in between. That was bullshit. She couldn't have missed like the third rollout. She she had to miss the very last one, the, the strongest one. I mean, thankfully she did, but fuck, dude. Come on. Come on. Oh, that was an ugly win for sure what what do you want a badge i want my fucking team back oh right i forgot here's the plane badge yeah fuck you whitney oh man <laughs> that's what oh god i'm gonna have so much grinding to do oh so much grinding so much Fucking dude, I'm. Oh, we might not even stream this tomorrow at this point. I gotta grind a whole new team. Charmeleon, I love you. I love you. Don't be sad. We won. All right, we need. Uh, we need to look at this shit. We need to take a good long look at this. Because I don't know what the fuck. Mother is not the time. It is not the time. This is not a good time. <clears throat> Talk about needing a drink. I need a whole 24 pack. Holy Fucking shit after that horse shit. <clears throat> wow.
Wow. I was expecting one Mon to die, but not all of them. I lost Muscles, my new friend. I lost Mary Jane, the Pokemon I love to have on my team. I lost Croconaw, my starter. Captain Crunch. And then I lost Buttface, who I wanted to die because I thought it would help the team, but it didn't help as much as it was supposed to. All right, guys, this is uh, this is the moment. All right, move Pokemon around. All right, so the next time y'all join me, because I ain't continuing the stream. Fuck that. I was gonna go till midnight, but uh, we got some grinding to do. We gonna have Zubat. We gonna have this guy. And um, let's go get an encounter real quick, because uh, we need some encounters. All right. Oh boy. Um, let's go ahead. Uh, after you beat the third gym, <laughs> you gotta come over here and get the water thing from this lady to make the tree die. Oh man, that's depressing. Wow. We lost our whole team. And I'm just going to name it. I'm just going to leave it at oatmeal. I was going to change the name to Quaker. But uh, I don't I don't think I will. At least you're not like William. That he lost his started from the start. I guess he means lost his starter from the start. Alright. Spiro's the optional one. I'm not going to keep it. All right, we gotta be careful around here. Trying to avoid as many battles as possible. Fuck. So I have to do this one. Please don't be the one with Diglets. You're the one with Diglets. Oh, I'm a fucking moron. I didn't even go to the Pokemon Center. Alright. Chocula. All you, buddy. Alright. Hot take. Sand Attack is a ground move. It should not work on flying Pokemon. Change my mind. Chocula, can you just astonish the fucker? Jesus Christ. I just want this battle to be done. I need to go get Pokemon. Deaths don't count in this one. I didn't go to the gym. I didn't go to the Pokemon Center. So, I am not counting these. Nope. Don't count. I need to get out of this battle. This is a mulligan right here. This whole battle is a mulligan. Should have never happened. I wasn't ready for anything. I was still grieving. Can't hold me to this. You can't hold me to anything. My heart is broken. I lost all my Pokemon. I'm so sad right now. 
Only way to help my heart is for you to subscribe. <laughs> oh man, this was not a good idea. Oh, you're doing a black two Nuzlocke? That's cool. Don't talk to me about Nuzlocke right now. Fuck this game. Fuck this game! Alright, I need to stock up on potions real quick. Kill my Pokemon. Then go get an encounter. See what I get. And then call it a day. Holy fucking hell. <clears throat> I certainly don't want to do the pseudo wudo uh, uh, thing right now. I'm gonna need Wooper to be at least a level 30 by the time we do that. Fucking Christ, dude. Oh lordy lord. Wow, that took all the steam out of what I was doing. Alright, uh, can we avoid this battle right here? Alright, cool. Oh, fuck you! I don't need your bullshit right now, danger lurking. Dragon Rage will end you. <clears throat> Told you guys, I should have been level 20 for that battle. <clears throat> I'm just kidding, Christian. You can talk to me about your Nuzlocke. But fuck, dude. If this ain't a kick in the balls right here. And I had a game plan too and I didn't execute it at all. I wanted to I wanted to uh, oops. I wanted to um smoke screen the milk tank turn one and I was so arrogant in my machop play. I'm cheating a Moonstone into this game somehow. I don't give a damn. That wasn't fair. Four. I only had one left. On nine HP. Think that's fair? Fuck off. Yep, that's your fault. Get the fuck out of here. It's not fair. This Nidoran's gonna be a Nido King! I give a fuck! It's gonna know Thunder, Blizzard, and fucking Fire Blast. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna figure it out. I'm gonna put it on there somehow, some way. Double kick me all you want, Nidoran. You getting on this team, bitch. My team's going to come back stronger than ever. <clears throat> I'm going to get an Umbreon. I'm going to have Charmeleon still, obviously. I'm going to have a Nido King. Crobat. I'm going to have a Quagsire. Alright, what do we name this thing? Eddie, where you at? I need a I need a serial name for Nidoran. <clears throat> Let 
não sei. Um, Fruity Pebble, <clears throat> I guess, works for me. The only thing I can see with the King on it is King Vitamin Cereal. Whatever. <sighs> Fruity Pebble. Damn, guys. Well, it doesn't fit. I'm just going to put Vitamin. Let you translate. Translate what? <clears throat> the history of your Nuzlocke? No! No, mother! What's over here? I know the bug competition, but it's not the bug competition time right now. That's tomorrow. Joe, Joe, welcome, Joe. You came at the most worst time of my stream right now. I lost my whole team, almost, almost lost the Nuzlocke. <clears throat> um, I the only time I lost boxes of Pokemon was doing a sword nuzlocke and i didn't even do it right <laughs> so i fucked myself basically in that nuzlocke <clears throat> and i'm also counting whatever encounter i get now different from the bug encounter so y'all could take that to the bank Two death boxes. Holy shit, dude. How do you get two death boxes? Are you solo running at the end of that? Bruh, Hoot Hoot is, is here, bruh. What the fuck? Can I get something other than Hoot Hoot here? Lordy, lordy, Jesus Christ. I know you get a sun cream, but I guess it has to be during the day, huh? Whoa, my character disappeared. I guess you can only get hoot hoot at night here? Holy shit. I'll take a Rattata at this point. It was like, <laughs> it was like, Rattata? Don't mind if I do. Why are there so many owls in this park? Good God, my Jesus. <laughs> Bruh, I need something other than a hoot hoot. I already have a hoot hoot. <clears throat> Alright, I'm going to skip this encounter for now. Holy shit balls. And for those who don't know, you can get through the fence right here.
<clears throat> so you can get the Soothe Bell, which helps with uh, friendly encounters. And then once you get uh, Rocks Climb, which is way fucking late game. I don't know why they have Rock Climb areas when you don't get it till the end of the game in here. But uh, it is what it is. Then you get Dig. You know what? Can I get a, 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 a tree encounter? You're in search for something? Yeah, for my team. No headbutt encounters? Really? Well, I know I can, but nothing popping out. I'll do two more tries and then just move on to the next area. I mean. Oh, fuck it. Nothing came out. Oh, well. I was hoping Pineco or something would pop out. Apom is my favorite tree encounter. Heracross would have been nice. Got a blue apricorn. I can't avoid this battle, can I? He just has abras though. So that's gonna be easy. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. All your stupid Pokemon. Yeah, 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 whatever. I don't care. Send out whatever you want, it's dead. You ain't got no HP. King Kong ain't got shit on me. Malibu's most wanted people. It's a great fucking movie. This ain't no picnic, bitch. Oh, now Pokemon don't want to fucking pop out. It's the same family. I'm not going to catch the same thing. Still a Nidoran. No, thank you. Okay, there's something different. Growl it. Growl it. And it has Intimidate. Alright, Kenny, you're going to help me out with this one. Growl it. Don't kill it. Okay. Oh, I was about to kill you, Kenya. Dumb broad. Fire doggy. All right. No point in keeping the stereo fucking thing going. Alright, can't really use this because we already got a fire type, but you know, fire dog. Huh. 
All right, guys. Well, that's it for this stream, really. I mean, there's nothing else I could do. I've got all the encounters impossible. Um, uh, I am going to try to work on grinding this team up all to level 20... 20, probably? Um, other than that, thank you guys for watching the stream. I really appreciate you all. We almost went five hours tonight. And um, if you haven't followed yet, go ahead and follow and join the Facebook group so we can have that giveaway. But uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will see y'all very soon. Thank you, Chicken Wheel. I will keep it up, man. And like I said, it's been a fun time. Hopefully you clip that uh, Whitney thing because that was God tier. So if you haven't, please do so. Because, uh, God, that's a moment right there. <laughs>